Yo, 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 what it do, baby? How's everyone doing? Welcome to another stream, right? Two days in a row. Sheesh. But yeah, we're going to be grinding some off meta towers, all right? There has been announced too a new update. We don't know exactly when it's coming out, but it is coming very, very soon, all right? So I linked down in the description below. It's going to be the first link, I think, uh, the patch notes, which was posted on the on the uh, BTD Bowers 2 Reddit, sorry. And uh, yeah, there's a lot of balance changes coming. There are going to be a few other tweaks as well. Let me let me go ahead and look at this really quick. All right. uh, uh, hacks and cheats will be resolved, hopefully. Balloon ramping changes, neutral balloon round changes as well, meaning AI balloons, um, and then a lot of tower balance changes, all right? So the, specifically, the two main things, they're gonna be fixing the Dartling Gunner, which is awesome. And then also too, they're gonna be fixing the Ninja uh, sticky bomb stacking, all right? Because that was not supposed to be a thing. Apparently, that was supposed to be fixed in the last update. I guess it just was never fixed. Uh, but yeah, Ninja won't be nearly as good, nor will the Dart Lane. So yeah, I don't really know what meta is going to be. I'm excited to see. But let me know what you guys think after looking um, at these tower balance changes, right? I am probably going to stick to using the ice. I saw some people saying the ice is going to be good. So glad that I am trying to grind XP for that right now. Um, I actually want to quickly go over to my ice. Okay, so I have 17,000 XP. So people have been saying Icicle Impale is actually freaking nuts. Um, so I, I, I could go for that, but I'm actually so close to just a super brittle, bro. Like, I feel like we can unlock it during the stream, all right? So I'm going to try to do that. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited, all right? Welcome, everybody. What is up? What is up? What is up? How's everyone doing? Spike getting nerfed? Really? I didn't see. Oh, wait. I did see that. Just a just a little bit though. Let me see again. I'm trying to find it. That's okay though. I've used the spike battery plenty, so spike battery base spike duration 50 to 40 seconds, and the spike storm no longer increase the emission rate from attack speed buffs. Interesting. Oh. Okay. Um I don't know how big of a deal that's gonna be. Hopefully not too big of a deal. Because if I make a push for Hall of Masters, I might have to use Spike Factory once again, you know? I love the Spike Factory. I absolutely adore it. How's everyone going? Yes. How's everyone doing? I mean, <laughs> let's hop into a game. Let's do it. Let's do it. So when is the update? We don't know. That's the thing. Hopefully soon, though. Hopefully very, very soon. Why don't I show my face in videos? I don't know. I kind of just... I just don't. I recently got this camera. I got this camera actually um, for Christmas. So hyped about that because I used to have a camera, but it, it was kind of it was kind of bad, low key. All right. So yeah, let's do it. Let's do it, boys. <clears throat> got Chipotle right here. Uh, I don't need that. Here's my phone too. All right, let's get it. How's everyone doing on this fantastic day? I hope everyone's doing well. I really, really do. So, we're going to be going with an ice as our first palm power tower, okay? Let's get it. We're starting up there. Perfect. He's going Dartling. Okay, that's fine. Now, I've been my fair share of Dartling users. Now, we're in Light Dungeon, okay? So, there's a lot of people that don't actually know how to use the Dartling Gunner. Um, I mean, like, it's not, like, hard to use. It's just, like, they don't know how to use it. Um, effectively sometimes, you know, like people struggle to like round 20, 45 months and stuff like that. Uh, fortified ZOMGs on round 22 as well. So we should use that to our advantage, right? Because clearly right now, like our strategy is not better than Dartling Gunner or probably mostly any Dartling Gunner strategy. Dartling is just that good. It is literally that good. Uh, but I'm going to go for Gwenny. Perfect. What's my favorite strategy? Probably it's Spike Factory. Okay, so like best favorite strategy, like that's actually good, is probably Spike Factory Dartling Village. Um, Gwenny, come on, Gwenny. Gwenny. <laughs> so if we would have set down an, a sub right there, that could have actually saved us. That's okay though. Um, so I'm gonna go for a sub, I guess like somewhere over here. I do want it to be, a, yeah, let's like go for like right there. Perfect. Saw so update click immediately. Yeah, so it's coming soon. 
not updated now. So hopefully no one like was misled by that. <laughs> that was my, not my intention. Uh, Gwen, okay, you popped that green, but the green before that you couldn't. Come on, Gwenny. Come on, Gwenny. All right, round five is here. Let's get it. Got to go for twin guns and then probably air burst as well. Yep. Here come these space whites. Okay, so this is where we struggle. This is where our strategy really struggles, actually. I'm going to go for Gwen's ability as well. We're going to be leaking some lives here, unfortunately. It's just the reality of this strategy, okay? But the good thing is, sub is actually pretty good on this map. So if we go for triple guns here, we're going to be absolutely chilling against pretty much all of this, okay? So this is exactly what I need to go for. I will be tanking some lives here, unfortunately, okay? So let's just hopefully go for this here. Okay, perfect. So... We actually cannot eco right now, so that's kind of a bad thing. But now, though, I think we should be pretty much A-OK -okay against all of these, all right? We're going to be able to use another Gwen ability here in a second as well. Okay, so we're going to uh, tank a few more lives, but it's okay. What is the best dart monkey strategy? I honestly do not know. I don't have too much experience with dart. I'm going to use Gwen's ability just to hopefully conserve some lives. Catch back up, too, because we're kind of chasing because these balloons in the back are right, but... Once our sub catches up, I think we should be good, honestly, all right? And he might leak here. No, he had enough money to upgrade to Powerful Darts, all right? So, well, well done. Yeah, so this is not my first time revealing my face, guys. I have done multiple... Like, I've had multiple videos on my channel where I've shown my face. And also, too, I have an Instagram. Which, by the way, you should go check out. And if anyone's confused and wants to see the patch notes, by the way, I did link it in the description below, right? It's going to be the first link. Go make sure to check it out. Um, it's about balance changes, um, issues with hackers, you know, all those good and fun things for this next upcoming update, all right? So super freaking hyped for it, all right? But I'm going to start ecoing with Space Blacks here now, all right? And I'm going to have to go for, obviously, another submarine, all right? So we're going to go for it right there. Perfecto. I'm just going to go for the 300 for now. And I don't think we need Reactor, like, right off rip. I'm going to send him some space leads here, too, just to force um, some sort of lead detection upgrade on his side. And then we're going to eco with some blues behind that. And then we should eventually be able to afford this Reactor here, okay? I think. Yeah, we should. All right, I'm not going to go for it just yet, because he's only ecoing with greens right now. See, like, look, this guy... He's using dart lanes, so, like, his strategy's better, for sure. Like, the fact that we only, we're only in 128 lives, like, that's pretty good for the strategy. Um, but you only need Hydro Bracket Pots. You do not need another dart lane. He should have just sold that. So, that doesn't make too much sense to me, honestly. But, let's continue on Eco Wayne with these yellow balloons here. By the way, if you guys are new to the stream, welcome. Make sure to drop a like if you have not already. And also, click that subscribe button for your boy, right? We're trying to hit 300 thousand subscribers and two i did post a video um i showcased the fits here bottom path of the submarine so you should definitely check that out uh, because it's a pretty cool video all right but currently we're at 293,271 okay so that means we're 729 subscribers away from hitting uh 294,000 all right so you might as well subscribe ask anyone that's already subscribed they'll tell you you won't regret it okay you just won't you got the leadiest freaking content in the community bro do I still play Balloon CD Battles 1? No, I do not. Yo, Christopher Devenger, thank you so much for the $5. I appreciate that, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That's very kind of you. Keep the content coming. Thanks for the informative vids. Oh, no problem, man. No problem, bro. Oh, did that not show up on the stream? I'm going to have to go like that that's why okay the super chat should show up on the screen now i'm sorry about that all right so uh oh okay this was kind of a fear of mine Ooh, two okay i'm gonna have to go for another sub here oh three okay yeah i'm gonna full on stop echoing all right i think we're actually gonna be fine against this though if we go for more range okay i'm gonna tower boost this though just to be safe because i'm not trying to die uh i, I could die here I could die could die. Oh, remove this too. Okay, we're good. Now that was a pretty aggressive rush from the young man. Super aggressive. Okay, so I'm actually gonna end up selling this. I'm gonna go for a few more apps towards the young man. Let's do it. All right, he went for rocket. Crap. <laughs> 
Fair play. At least I forced an upgrade. See, like, he went for another Darling on top of that and tower boosted. Oh my god, you got Rocket, bro. Uh, tower boosted or balloon boosted. Maybe ceramics might sneak through. Nah, he's completely fine. Well done. Darling is just so good, bro. Yo, Gretchen Decker, thank you for the five dollars. You guys are so nice. Thank you, thank you. Yo, what's up, LJ? Yes, so there will be new maps with this new update. Yes, yes, yes. So, what they're gonna do with Hall of Masters and ZOMG, those arenas, they want to remove these uh three maps, these long maps, okay? Docks, Mayan. And Blutonia Mines, okay? Because in higher arenas, like, I don't know. It's just too easy for those players to just easily go, like, late game. You know what I mean? Like, because they're in the highest arena for a reason. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. In order to fix that, they just want to completely remove those maps. Uh, which is something they actually did in BTD Battles 1 as well. They would remove uh, long maps like that, okay? So, by the way, I'm just going to go from a middle path. So, our reactor's a little bit better, I guess. Why not? Um, he's also going village. Dude, he's probably going Spike Factory. But, yes. They're going to be removing those three maps, and they want to add more shorter maps. So, yeah. Shorter maps are just more competitive. It's just, it's the truth, for sure. And I, I think they're going for a more competitive game. Um, And definitely that would help out Hollow Masters, for sure. So, yeah. Definitely Docs. Like, Docs, 100%. Plutonium Mines, super easy to go late game, and man, as well. Um, They could have also removed, probably, um, what's that one map? Um, Sands of Times? That's a pretty long map. But, it's fine. But I'm excited to see uh, the new maps because, like, I'm already getting, like, kind of tired seeing these maps over and over. Like, I don't know. We just played on all of these maps so much. It's crazy. But the updates after. Possibly. Uh, they have it listed in the patch notes, though. So, who knows? So, I'm going to go for, by the way... I'm gonna go for an ice over here. It's kind of hard to set down sometimes. All right, so why did he sell that? Uh, we could, by the way, I can't believe he only has two rocket storms there. We could send him a fortified ZOMG. Let's do it. This guy, like, he's not bad, but fortified ZOMG will be kind of harder for him to defend against. Why is he not revealing his third and final tower is my question. He's just gonna spam Darling Gunners. That's an interesting way of defending. Can I have tower boosting that as well? All right, so I'm going to send another. Yo, Potsart, thank you for the dollar, man. I appreciate that. Dude, I don't think he's going to be able to defend against this, Loki. I'm going to send him another. It, it's really spaced out, but it's fine. Um, Yeah. I think he might be dead here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to balloon boost these. He's going to have to use two Rocket Storms. Or actually, yeah, he has two right now. I don't think two Rocket Storms will be able to defend. Because they're not in the back of the map either. So, like, once it starts going down this path, he might be screwed. Even with the boost. Oh, wait. Are we screwed? <laughs> Make sure that we can defend ourselves. Oh, yeah. He's screwed. 100%. He is so unbelievably dead. I'm going to end up balloon boosting this in a second. Oh, yeah. I mean, it just... GG's, GG's. See, it feels great to take down a Darling user. Let's get some W's in the chat, baby. Let's go, dude. GG's, man. I always love taking down Darling users. See, like, he's using Darling, and he just, like, he didn't know what he was doing, though. I don't know why he didn't reveal his third and bottom tower. I kind of set down Super, by the way, just so I could get a little bit of XP right there, right? So, GG's all around. Bala Richard, 005 sub is a... Support tower, also check pop count. Bala, I've seen your comments. I need to remember that. <laughs> I saw it. I remember a lot of people liked it too, and they wanted me to check pop counts. I I've got to remember that, all right? Yo, and thank you so much for the dono. I appreciate that, man. Thank you, thank you. When's the update? Judah, we don't know. But if anyone's still confused, there are patch notes in the description below. It's going to be the first link. Go to the Battles through Reddit, and Ninja Kiwi just put out something today about future... Um, balance changes they want to do with the next update and also some other things as well right so should definitely go make sure to check it out Ooh, i just got some xp from that chest so i'm gonna go for super monkey fan club is that the way to go i don't know but i kind of just wanted to have that so maybe we can incorporate dart in some of these games today so yeah i'll try to do that i'm gonna save up for this and then super monkey i don't even know what it should go for to be honest with y'all like people say that dart champion is not worth uh, I mean, Tech Terror is only 19k, so we could go for that. Like, that is a cheap upgrade, actually. 
uh sun temple yeah 100k <laughs> that's quite expensive but eventually i would like to go over that so like i could use it for a video and dude guys they're adding a casual mode too i'm so hyped about that bro like going wacky strategies and stuff is going to be way easier for me and then i can also like um you know keep my competitive side at times you know like so in ranked matches i can use actual decent strategies and then in casual i can just like me like literally just like use glue and stuff uh dino again i'm gonna skip although dino's a really good map for the strategy i'm gonna skip it though just so we have a little bit something else castle ruins is also a pretty good map uh for the strategy so i'm super hyped about that let's get it i just looked at the post on reddit it said they most likely won't add okay gotcha 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 so they won't add new maps in the next update but they plan on doing it eventually What's the new meta? Currently, the meta is the same. So, Ninja Dartling Sniper. And, like, I see it a lot. I'm in, I'm in Lead Dungeon, guys. I gotta get up to, like, my pit or something, bro. But, um, I see the meta a lot. It's just, like, these people in, like, these lower arenas, they like, don't really know what they're doing. By the way, they honestly, too, I think they said something about, in the next update, they want to, like, limit upgrades. Um based on what arena you're in. So, for example, I think Lead Dungeon, you can only use up to fourth tier upgrades. That's a pretty big deal. I'm not trying to be in freaking Lead Dungeon then. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> By the way, I'm going to go for Ice here. Let's do it. Go for 110. All right. And then I'm going to go for Gwenny eventually. Probably somewhere like to the left of the ice. Let's go, boys. If you're new to the stream, make sure to click that subscribe button, all right? We're trying to hit 294,000 subscribers. I know we can do it, all right? So we were like 729 away, I think. And now we're only 693. Let's go, baby. All right, yeah. So let's go for Gwenny right next to this ice. Uh, we might leak lives here. Yeah, we're going to leak. We're going to leak, possibly. Ooh. Oh, that one red. That one red. Do you see it? <laughs> Hopefully this sub down here can uh, clean it up because I want to go for a sub. Incredible. Sub, get it for me. Uh, I don't think it did. Oh, look at that. Look at it. Look at it. You can see it. You can barely see it. Did it get it? I think it did. <laughs> that was so funny, dude. No, no. Oh, I did leak. No shot. I'm just bad at the game. Blooms again because Batman is obviously a ripoff of the Super Monkey upgrade called the Legend of the Night. Bruh. I'm suing, bro. What? Yo, thank you, Judah, for the five. Appreciate it, man. Thank you. Please play the next game of Spike Factory. Guys, Spike Factory is my most used tower ever. I'm not trying to use that. I used it so much in uh, the first season. Which, by the way, I get this question a lot, or well, I have been recently. Um, people ask what my ranking was in the last season. Oh my god, I did not mean to go for heat. Oh my god. That is not good. <laughs> so eventually, we need to go for triple here. I might tower boost this as well. I think I'm going to. Mm, actually, right now, we're doing kind of better than I anticipated. We're going to leak, of course, but that's an end up. That's inevitable with this strategy. Oh my god, they're buffing the heck out of the sub, though. Let's go, like, Ballistic Missile and stuff. I'm so hyped about that. Because, like, it's not in a good state right now. Alright, let's go for that. Perfect. Now, hopefully we can do a little bit better. Once we get Gwen's ability back, we can catch up to these balloons. I forget. I was going to say something, too. I forget. Oh, yeah. People keep on asking me, um, what was my ranking? I was 89. I did say that in one of my videos, but the thing is, I would have got a higher ranking, but there were so many hackers in Hall of Masters, guys. I didn't want to risk it, bro. Like, if I want to get, if I would have went against a hacker, I could have just, like, lost and then got taken out of top 100. That would have been a super no bueno thing, you know? So, that's kind of why I just didn't play. I knew I could, like, secure the top 100. Actually, I was kind of on the fence about it. I actually stayed up until, like, 5 a.m. because that's when the season ends for me in my time zone. And... I just wanted to make sure that I was top 100, you know? So, yeah. 
It ended up working out. I'm gonna use Gwen's ability again. I mean, dude, honestly, this is a dub right here. If we have more than 100 lives, that's a huge dub for us with this strategy. I'm not gonna lie, because, like, dude, space whites are freaking tough for us at times. Very, very much so. Um, so, yeah, I'm gonna start saving up for this reactor. He's already got Hydra. See, like, this guy's going dart lane, of course, first of all. But the, the fact that he already went for Hydra that early. Oh, he did sell the other one of those, though. Okay, um, this could be an issue for us here. This definitely is going to be an issue for us, I think. Um, hmm. I'm going to be able to go for reactor here in a second. Actually, we're kind of chilling, all right? This was going in for us. Let's go. All right, so now that we got reactor, we could probably get away with full on equaling now with yellows. What hacks were they using? What kind of hacks? So they weren't like money hacking or anything like that. Uh, they were... <laughs> Hacker is probably not the right term. They weren't like, you know, just spamming towers and like upgrading to like sun gods and stuff or whatever. Um, they more were like glitching or using exploits in the game. And they would like freeze your balloon send. So like, for example, like this guy, he would like freeze the ability for me to be able to send him balloons. So, like, there's just no way I can beat him because, one, I can't get up Eco. Two, I can't even rush him. So, like, I just stand no chance. And another way they would do their little glitches um, is they would just crash your game. Actually, not crash, but they would make you lag out. Like, immediately. Like, just right at, start, right at the start of round one or sometime between or before round five, I'm sorry. Uh, they would eventually lag you out. And two, they would make the loading screen before the game, like, just continuously go. So, they would just hope that you would eventually leave. So, yeah. I know someone, Aiden's YT. If you guys know Aiden's, I just did a video with him. Um, he was top 100, bro. And then he found a hacker, and he literally waited over an hour and a half. And he just finally said, screw it. And that kept him out of top 100. Like, that is so stupid, bro. He deserves a T100 badge. And there were also people in top 10 that got thrown out due to hackers. I think the first five spots were all filled by hackers. Allegedly. Allegedly. I think there was one booster in there. But, like, who actually knows, you know? By the way, this guy's strictly going meta. Freaking Dartling Sniper, man. Oh, my God. They are nerfing the heck out of Sniper. I am so hyped about it, bro. <laughs> I hope Sniper is terrible. I hope Dartling is also terrible. And I hope Ninja is terrible. I hope all three of them are terrible. All right. Um, hmm. Go for Ballistic here. Go for Advanced Intel as well. Hmm. That's going to hurt us a little bit. We're not dead, right? We're not. But that did sting a little bit. It did sting a little, little bit. Okay, so I don't think I can fit another sub in here. We could fit four. Keep up the good work. Yo, Pierce, thank you for the $2 donation, brother. I appreciate that, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So if he sells this, he already has, like, Elite Defender, I think, is what he's trying to upgrade to. Ooh, okay. Um, hmm, okay. All right, I'm going to tower boost that as well. I might be dead here. I am dead. Oh my god, I'm dead. I'm so dead. Are we actually? No, we're good. Wow. Wow is correct. GG's. I thought we were dead. Alright, so we could force an upgrade on his side. Uh, we could send him like fortified mobs here. Yeah, you went for another supply drop? Yeah, we're gonna do that. We actually should do that probably now. All right, so we could go for the Elite Defender. Oh, wait, they're fast cooldown on round 19? Since when? Wow, he went for man. Fair enough. Mmm, I thought that looked a little bit worse for him. Maybe I should have balloon boosted a little bit earlier. It's all good, though. Well done. Why do monkey pop balloons? Like, what do the balloons do? Bro, Judah, you're right, bro. The balloons have feelings too, man. <laughs> Thank you for the donut, bro. <laughs> uh. Seven forty-five BAD. You're right. 
Or BFB? Oh, no. BFB is collapse. Easy collapse for him. He still has man, too, so I'm not going to do that. All right, so he said go, go, go. He's going to be sending me a fortified ZOMG. Yep. Okay, I'm just going to stop eco in here for a second, and I'm probably going to end up actually selling this so I can get a little bit more cash coming in. Um, so, yeah. Oh, of course, bro. No, bro. This is not good. This is not good. What? I'm just running out of money. Oh my god, I'm so dead. I can't even go for first strike. Dang. Oh, I didn't even go to the Moabs, bro. GG's. Dang! That was a really tough rush. I don't know what more I could have done there. When it's fortified? I can't one pop ZOMGs with first strike. I just don't I didn't have enough money to micro it either. Dang. GG's. We did all, all of what we could there. Thank you for your patience. There's only so much you can do when you go against meta too. Yo Judith, thank you for that two dollars, brother. Are they adding multi touch? Now there wasn't any talk about that in the Reddit post. Um so I would have to say no. Uh, but they need to make that up. Like, they don't even have, like, they have, like, subheadings for each, like, thing they want to talk about. Tower balance changes, hacks and cheats, balloon ramping changes, n neutral balloon round. I don't know why they use the word neutral. It's natural balloon, AI. Um, but there's no subheading for, like, lag. Because clearly lag is an issue. It's a big... I mean, if it's an issue on PC, imagine mobile. I actually... I remember I went against this guy that I know. His name is VTD Scrub. And uh, he plays on mobile. And literally, we were going late and he just lagged out. Like, I was like, dude, come on, bro. Like, I feel bad. Like, I don't want to get a win based off of disconnection issue. You know what I'm saying? Yo, Coney! What's up, man? I'm doing great. How are you? You didn't have to donate, bro. Thank you, though. I appreciate that. Yeah, I'm doing pretty good. Uh, maybe we should go for ice, by the way, down here. Maybe that wouldn't be a bad move. Do I leak this? Do I leak that? Do I leak that? Oh, I do! Oh, no, I don't. <laughs> thank you for your so the reason why... Thank you, Coney, again. Doing Botrix? Oh, Botrix? Oh, now we got a problem. I thought you just said Botrix. <laughs> No, but uh, the reason why I went for ice down here is because I don't want this future air burst starts right here to be, like, trying to pop frozen balloons because it just can't. So, yeah, that's why I did that. Uh, we're also going to go for Gwenny in here. I've made some minor modifications. This ice spot, OP, though. See, everybody, go everybody still goes dart lane. Like, I have no intentions of, like, increasing my trophy count right now. I mean, I... I I should probably get out of Blend Dungeon, though. <laughs> the games will be a little bit easier, but still, there are some, like, pretty valid players in this as well. I, I mean, it, it's just so hard. Like, you don't really have to be, like, all that good to, like, win with Dart Lane. No offense to anyone that uses Dart Lane. I used it last season, but, like, it's just... It's just really easy to use because you just go for Hydra Rocket Pod to 2-3-0 Dart Lane for mid-game, and then you're completely chilling. And then if your opponent sends you 4-5 mobs, just Rocket Storm... And, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, the one thing that most players struggle to when using Dart Lane in these in uh, Lead Dungeon is Fortified ZOMGs. And they're honestly not too difficult depending on what your other towers are. So, yeah. I'm going to end up going for a sub, though. Let's go for that. I'm going to go for him. I'm also going to send Space Whites here. He's probably going to be doing the same thing towards me. So, I'm going to need to do this. And, uh, ooh... <laughs> Ooh. So I'm gonna go for barbed. I normally go for barbed during mid game. I'm also gonna I'm gonna leak here. Alright. Because I forgot to use Gwenny's ability. Sorry, Gwen. Uh, but I do go for barbed because sub stars can pop an additional three balloons. That helps us against these space whites for the meantime. Eventually, though, I would like to sell this off. Because then I would rather have infinite range if I do have a bottom path uh submarine, you know? So yeah. We could have went for triple guns right there, by the way. But, like, honestly, this strategy is pretty solid on a map like this, too. There's a lot of, like, room, like, spaced out between the sub and the ice. So, it makes this strategy work. He already went for laser shock, by the way. See, like, that leads me to believe that, like, this guy, like, isn't that good. Because you don't need laser shock that early. 
COVID now. Yo, Kyle, I'm King. Thank you for the two. Oh, you got COVID, man. I hope you get better, bro. And yo, Bra Guy, thank you for the dollar, man. I appreciate that. Thank you guys so much for the donations. Yeah, I, I got COVID back in May. Um, so I hope you can get through it, man. That really sucks. By the way, it's round seven. Let's send him some yellow balloons. He actually might struggle here a little bit. He does have laser shock, though. I don't know how much that's going to help him. What do you think of the farm in the upcoming update? Dude, farms might be low-key freaking goaded, bro. Drunk stream collab again when? Asian, you trying, you trying to do one? Let's do it soon, bro. I'm down. Let's do it. Those are so much fun, bro. And dude, with BTD Battles 2, oh, it'd be spicy. I wish there were tournaments, though, Asian, bro. Like, come on. Why aren't there tourneys? I guess we would just 1v1 each other. Oh, I am like nowhere near being able to get up this reactor. That is kind of unfortunate. Ooh, and white balloons here. Okay, I'm going to use one of these ability. Hopefully it will be, for the most part, good against all of these. Might leak a few lives. Uh, yeah. That one red. We got it. We got it, boys. He went for Hydra. He's got another Darlene and an Engineer. See, like, you'd only need one Hydra Rocket Pods. That's literally all you need when you use Darlene. All right, so let's get to eco now with yellows. Yo, what's up, Jason and Corey? What's good? I'm driving, can't chat, but I'm listening. <laughs> All right, yeah, eyes on the road. No looking at the phone. <laughs> Turnies we need. I know, bro. That's so that's so bad, man. I could like, if like, we could like one v one, and then like we could like switch over to battles one. You know, because like I feel like after a while we'll probably get a little bit bored of just one v one each other. But if we're tipsy, then, like, I don't know, maybe we'll just vibe, too. Who knows? But, yeah, like, I, I like incorporating the viewers in streams. I really do. People, like, ask the 1v1 in the, the streams I do now. But, like, I kind of just want to grind XP also, too, at the same time for other towers. And if there were just tournaments, I definitely would want to do that. You know? Just incorporates more people. If there were, like, 32-player tournaments, that would be so sick, bro. We got to tell NK. We got to tell NK about that, bro. Like, there's so many streamers, like, so many people stream this game. Like, I see people streaming on Twitch all the time and stuff. Like, bro, that would be just so nice. That would help for, like, like say we had a balloon super tournament or something. Like, that would, tournament, tournament mode uh, would really help us out, you know? The update is wonderful. Yes, sir, dude. They buff in the freaking sub. I'm hyped. Because this sub is terrible right now. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie at all, dude. It is not that good. What's up, Steam Steam? New update. So there is currently no new update. There will be one coming soon, though. If you want to go check out the patch notes, first link in the description below. It was posted on the Battles 2 Reddit. Um, yeah. There's like a lot of new upcoming changes and things that they want to add to the game. So I'm so excited, man. So excited. 200 ice can pop camo after update. Really? Are we good against this, by the way? No, we're not. We're dead. Jesus. We're so dead. I have no money to do anything either. I just want XP for this tower. <laughs> GG's. Oh my god, that was so OP. I didn't think we were going to struggle that much. I went for ice shards too. That did absolutely nothing. So I guess that was just a waste of money. Dang. We were looking so good too there. What if I mobs, man? They're no joke. GG's. Any new heroes? No, not right now. Plutonium, so we can play. Sub is just not that good on this map, though, unfortunately, because all the water's at the bottom, but we'll make things work. Yeah, should I pin, like, a message, like, saying, like, patch.
right, we'll do that. Oop, pen. Get back here. We'll go for this. Perfect. Awesome. What the heck is this guy doing? No shot. Is he just giving me the win? More ice XP. Oh, he's actually not giving me the win. <laughs> he just decided to start off with the open for whatever reason. What? That was not the play. That was not the play, bro. Alright, who's this, bro? I miss Balloon Shipper. Yeah, I think it's like too hard for them to code in this game. I mean, it's already laggy as is, you know, so it'd probably be pretty tough. All right, so let's go for this. It's like, do we go for longer range or what? I mean, he's gonna get lies off of me. No shot, he, I mean like, no shot I fully defend. Twin Guns is so bad, dude. Do I Tower Boost? No, I'm not gonna Tower Boost. I'm just gonna take the lives, it's all good. It's all good. He wanted some payback, bro, right there, I guess. Because I got him down to 62. I think, like, games like this should be a thing. I don't think most games should go past round 40. Unless you're on a late game map, I guess, which this is a late game map. Um, but I think leaking lives early should be more common. I really, really do. But with Dart Lane, I mean, this guy did it completely wrong. But with Dart Lane, you just don't leak. You just don't. I mean, other towers too, like Boomer, you can get away with no leaks. Um, I'm trying to think of another tower. I can't really. Tax Shooter, you can get away with no leaks. He's already going for Ninja? What? What is this guy doing? So I went for longer range. I don't know if this is the player or not. I'm going to end up using Gwen's ability here, and we're probably going to have to tower boost. Maybe. Because, like I said, water's at the bottom of the map, so it's not the most optimal thing to go sub on this map, but... Hopefully now with this 103, we can do a little bit better. Oh god, I cannot wait. What the? What is it doing? It's terrible. <laughs> it's so bad. This one though will be barbed. Oh my god, we are struggling out here. Jesus, space whites are no joke for the strategy, dude. All right, I think we're chilling now. <laughs> Alright, let's start sending yellows too. No shot he can defend yellows with this strat. The heck, he already went for a ninja so early, dude. Like, what? Ice meta? Hopefully, dude. People were actually saying ice could be meta in the next update, so I'm pretty hyped about that. Does he really have a, he has a flash bomb? I didn't know that was a flash bomb, to be honest with y'all. What? What is this, dude? I know probably some of these are hitting this crystal right here. I just don't have the money in order to remove it right now. I kind of want to spend my money on eco rather than removing this because I think this is 500. Yeah, it's 500. Okay, so yeah. I'm going to eco just a little bit harder with these yellows and then I'm going to start space eco and save enough money for my reactor. Look, we're barely defending right now. Like, what in the world, dude? Yeah, reactor is not good in this map, so he could be aggressive during these mid game rounds. Gotta watch out for that. Regent rainbows towards the reactor. It's actually pretty tough to defend against. Nobody dare tries, though. No, some people do. And, like, it ends poorly almost every time, so. Oh, no, 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 no. I already know this will be, this will be tough. Go in for me. Go in for me. Jesus. Oh, my God. Are we good? Oh, wait. I'm sending constant blacks, too. Did not mean to do that. Oh, dude, look at that. I'm just gonna tower boost, dude. Like, bro. They're are like, like they're chasing so terribly. I just I have Gwenny to pop leads, dude. Get out of here. He's so aggressive, bro. Oh my god, no 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 no. We're dead, right? We're so dead, right? Look at that! Reactor is so bad! Reactor is so terrible! Oh my god, it's so terrible. What even, bro? That's so bad. Wow, like, I don't, like, I don't know how I defend that. 
I think on Blutonium, I need to switch on my strat. I can't be going sub, bro. It's so terrible on that map. That's so bad. Yeah, I'm not using... Okay, so like, see, like, on Castle Ruins, sub ice is actually... It's actually good. Like, it's literally good. Okay, I shouldn't say good. It's not... This strategy is not good right now. <laughs> but with future updates, hopefully it will be better with this next update. Because, like, right now, sub is, like, definitely very mid. Very, very mid. If not below mid. It is just not that good. For whatever reason, they nerfed the reactor. Are they buffing it again? Let me see right now. No, they're not. Bro! They kind of freaking buff the reactor. It's so terrible now. They are buffing the armor-piercing darts, though. Triple guns, airburst darts, ballistic missile, damage from 1 to 2 for balloons in 6 to 8 to ceramics. Um, preemptive strike missile damage 1 to 10. Ceramics 15 plus damage. And the activated abilities on it will be immediately ready. Which is good. Oh, no. Oh, my God, man. It is so terrible, though. <laughs> Jesus. Like, there's some... Like, on this map, like, see, reactor, it goes around, you know, blue and path, it goes around this, like, little cir circular path. <laughs> so, it's a little bit better on a map like this. Plutonium? No. It's it's not the it's not the move on Plutonium. It is not the move. I won't use it anymore in there. But the thing is, I don't know... See, I'm gonna leak here, by the way. I always leak one life. Oh, no. Gwendolyn Wendron for me. Thank you, Gwenny. See, every game, every game so far. I'm in Lead Dungeon, bro. Every single game I've won against Dartling. Like, come on, bro. Switch it up. Switch it up for me. Why would anyone want to get into Hall Masters, like, right now, too? Think about it, guys. The season does not end for, like, what? 52 days? 53 days? Something like that? Bro, why would you want... Why rush to get into Hall of Masters? Start grinding XP for other towers, especially with this update coming up. You don't want to get in the Hall of Masters and then just be stuck there. That is not the play. I'll tell you that right now. That is definitely not the play. Buff glue? Yes, they are buffing glue, thankfully. Yeah, like seriously, the glue is like nearly unusable right now. It is so bad. Like, come on, I'm trying to use glue, bro. It actually, the, the crazy thing is, too, if you did not play Battles 1, dude, it actually, like, is somewhat good in Battles 1. No joke. It's pretty good. Oh. Should I, should I tower boost this or nah? Okay, yeah, that's it. Oh my god. Space Whites, bro. Space Whites with this strategy is my biggest nightmare. It's just so hard to defend. Once we go for this triple guns, though, we should be fine. Okay, we still can't go for it. See, this sub is actually hitting some of the frozen balloons, which is kind of a bummer. Once we can use Gwendy, Gwendy's ability again, hopefully we'll be good. We can catch back up a little bit. And yeah. So yeah, let's just use her ability now. I'm going to start equaling too with yellow balloons here. Oh my god. Jesus, bro. Do better. Do better. Come on, sub. What's wrong, sub? All right. Are we good now? Maybe I should set this to, like, last. All right. Oh, no. Are we... We're not dead at that, right? Okay, good. Putting this on last? Oh, my God. It's so much better. Holy crap. That's insane. I need to remember to do that. Look how much better this is. Wow, that's nuts. All right. Got to remember that next time.
Ooh. I use Gwenny's ability. No. Get out of here. I'm just going to tower boost again. It's my third and final one. Shoot. I shouldn't have tower boosted. I should not have done that. I'm... Oh, my God. He's just... <laughs> Guys, he's using meta. Come on. Give me a break. Give me a break, bro. I can't catch a break against these meta users, bro. Even in lead dungeon, dude. Do I have to drop to yellow stadium, man? Full to use Jason balloons? What are Jason balloons? The lack of targeting throughout these games is hurting my soul. What? Can't target ice. What should I target? Hurt is strong. Sick. What should I target this? first <laughs> definitely not submerged that that's not the way listen lord i'm i'm not a pro i'm i'm a late gamer at heart balloons with fangs oh yo etiquette what's up how's it going thank you for the don't know yeah, okay, so now, okay, at least now we know, put this bad boy on last, and we're chilling. So, so Merge is out the way? Yeah, you're right. Let's, let's put this bad boy on first. So Merge is definitely the way. And they're using Darling Sniper Ninja here as well. Are you serious? Dude, you can't get, like, you can't escape it, I guess. That's crazy, man. Oh, yeah. Okay, Jerry, I'm not the best. I appreciate it, though. Thank you. Um, I might die here. Because I can't even tower boost. Oh, wait. I definitely should not have went for bottom path there. Oopsies. He's not even ecoing. He is going sniper, though. So maybe that's why. I don't really know. When is the update? Don't know. Submerge the... Oh, yeah, you're right. Submerge that. So maybe you want this back to strong. I guess. I don't know. How good is armor-piercing darts? Apparently, it's supposed to do additional damage. All right. Oh, I don't have a tower boost. I'm so dead. 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 I am so dead. No. GG's. No! The spirits of the forest awaken. <laughs> Dang it! GG's. I can't I can't compete! I can't compete out here! I can't compete against the freaking Dartley! I just can't compete! Would you get out of here? Alright. We're winning this. We are winning this one. Mark my words. Mark my words. We're winning. Sub is not really good tower. Yes. Yeah, so you're you're not wrong. We need sub to be like somewhat decent for us until like round twenty five, and then after I don't really care, because then we'll use super. Whoa. What do you know? Another Darling user. <laughs> Another. <laughs> every single game, every single game so far that guys this stream, we've won against a Darling user. <laughs> oh my. I don't know. Like you would think like with the new season, like you would take a chill pill and like not care about like using meta, I guess. Cause like, what's the rush to to um, to Hall of Masters? You know, like there, there's no rush. Chill. We got 53 days. We got 53 days, bro. Chill. Let, let, let's let's use some off meta towers. You know. But no, 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 no. We use Darlene every game, every game, without fail. <laughs> the of 
Don't don't turn crazy. <laughs> Guys, I'm completely chilling right now. It, it's all good. If I genuinely did care, I would just I would play their game and also go dart lane, but why? I did that all of season one. I don't want to do that anymore. Like I'm catching L's left and right here, but like if I genuinely like wanted to try and like wanted to use Dart Lane, Village, Spike Factory, I easily could, but like what's the point? I'm not in a rush to get to Hall of Masters. I'm trying to learn more about this strategy and grind XP for these towers. Straight up. That is my main concern. Oh, are we actually gonna get no lives lost? Should we put this one on last two then? Oops. Is that the wave? Okay, we're gonna leak. No! That one dreaded red. It's all good. I use sub, ice, and boomer, and I am on six win streak in CC. The key to beating Dart and users is early four to five laps. Yo, Epic Money, thank you for the tip, bruh. But yeah, your strategy doesn't have longevity. That's the one thing. Because you can't defend DDTs. You just can't with that strat, unfortunately. Did I need to go for triple guns? Maybe not. Definitely not. That was a waste of money. So I'm still showing 142 lives now. Um, but yeah, if you make it to round 26, like, you're done with that strat. Like, you, you got no chance with that strategy. And I've already grinded XP for Boomer, so I don't personally want to use Boomer. Now, I think I should possibly try switching out the sub because I do have mastery and I have everything unlocked now uh, with the sub. So, yeah. But yeah, early 4 to 5 mobs do work against Dartling users, but it, it's such an easy defend at the same time because all you have to do is Rocket Storm and then you're absolutely chilling. That's what sucks. It's just too easy to defend against everything with Dart Lane. It's just, it really is. It just truly is too easy with it. There's really not too much skill involved with using the Dart Lane Gunner. It's just so good. All right, so I'm going to go for that right there. Use Gwenny's ability because there's a yellow, so I'm scared. See? This guy, this guy knows. I don't know why he set down Ninja. Maybe he thought he was going to get an early whim off the Space Whites. I guess. That wasn't going to happen. Ain't no way, bruh. All right. Let's get to eco in now with these yellows. Bet that this dude's last tower is Sniper. Oh, one, oh, one, one hundred percent. One, no doubt in my mind is not. No doubt in my mind it's not, dude. Yo, what's up, KK? How's it going, bro? Use Spike Factory again? Yeah, I'm not going to use that. I'm sorry, guys. I don't want to use Spike Factory. That's not fun for me. I literally made an entire video on this. <laughs> I wanted to switch up my strategy and use towers that are not meta. Because clearly, like, Dart Lane is still meta. And, like... If I wanted to win right now, I could just go dart lane. But I don't I don't want to do that. There's no rush to Hall of Masters. I'm just trying to learn more about these towers and grind XP mainly for the ice. Because I think ice... I saw a lot of people on Reddit saying that it's going to be meta. Hopefully that's the case. Because we just started grinding XP for it. Also too, I'm trying to grind XP for the Super Monkey. We do have Dark Knight. And that's like mainly what everybody uses. But I kind of just want to also get eventually like... Um, True Sun God and stuff like that. So I can use those for content and k killed it late game i know so like is it like gonna be really bad kk like it's gonna be like really really bad if so that sucks the heck am i supposed to use wait why can't i scroll up and down on this what the heck i wonder if going for a super is better than going for a ballistic missile because currently ballistic missile does nothing <laughs> ballistic missile is not that good i don't know we'll use it though
Yeah, so it says for the super, or I'm sorry, spike factory, base spike duration is 50 to 40 seconds, and then the spike storm no longer increase the emission rate from attack speed buffs. Does that mean, like, there's no point of using Homeland? Or am I tripping? It's going to be unusable past round 30. Aw. What? Why? <laughs> it just creates too much lag? That's probably the main reason. They're like, yeah, it's good, but we're mainly doing this because of lag. No homeland, no boost, nothing. That is so dumb. That's actually so dumb. What the heck am I supposed to use now? <laughs> what the heck? This next update will be interesting then, to say the least. Yeah, homeland increases damage by 100% for 20 seconds on all towers on the map. But with this next upcoming update, I guess that's not going to be a thing. Yo, you should try out Dartling Gunner. Areklo! Dartling Gunner? Is it really that good? Is it? Is it the move, dude? I don't know. I've never used it, man. I also haven't used Sniper or the Ninja. So, like, I, I kind of want to use Dartling Sniper Ninja. Because, like, nobody uses it. And I think it's very underrated. I think it could be really, really good. Yeah, bro. I tried out. Dude, that. I'm going to do it. Although, honestly, I think one of the best towers in the game right now is blue for sure. So, kind of want to use that as well. No, Darling Hunter is trash. At least the Groot pinks. Bruh. I know. Look at them. He's struggling to these pinks, dude. Look. They're, s they're getting through, bro. He might have to. He might tower boost this. Blue gunner? Ooh, etiquette. Yeah, you're right. I might have to. I might have to do that. Just pull the trigger finally, you know? Yeah, Arekalo, you were right, by the way, with your um list of in order the most broken towers. Dartling is just it's just a different breed, bro. Cause it's always good. It's good early, it's good mid, it's good late. It's always good. Should try glue gunner. I heard it's meta right now. <laughs> explain the update there's a link in the description below if you want to check it out there's a uh, patch notes for it any upgrades on alchemist yes i used to use alchemist now i heard that using alchemist on a sub commander is pretty good actually no sorry not a sub commander actually well any upgrade on the sub is pretty good is that true should i try out like a sub alk strategy out go like sub alk I don't know. Super? Ice? But, like, if I went sub alk ice, I'd probably just use that on docks. His last tower sniper. What do you know? Like, why are people using this strategy in lead dungeon, bro? Get out of this arena! Go to PFP. Go to ZMG. Go to Home Masters. Get out of this arena. I don't want to play against you. <laughs> like, come on. Are we really not to... Dude! Bro, sub is so bad. What the heck? Why did I struggle to that so much? <laughs> that was incredibly bad. All right, so I'll go for another super right here in this corner. Yeah, let's do it. Drop down a red balloon camp. I'm going to have to at this point. Sheesh. So when do I stop ecoing? Because normally I have village and I normally have easily over five thousand most games. But like, <laughs> guys, I'm so I'm so screwed. He has three cripples up. Four, not cripples. Sorry, man, mobs. Sorry, I know I always call him cripple because that's what it's called in BTB Battles One. Uh, but come on, bro. The rocket gets eight times damage buff. Yeah, yeah, dude. I know, because it does terribly right now. I don't know why they nerfed the first strike, too. And also, there's not going to be a cooldown, which is, will be super duper nice. Should I just all out with DDTs, by the way? He has no DDT defense right now. But, like, it's kind of an easier defend, but he's got to have pretty solid micro in order to do that. So, 
We just try it. And why not? It's it's meta, so. Oh wait, I can't defend AI. Oh no, that's not good. Oh no. <laughs> Let's go, baby! Get out of here with meta, bro! Get out of here! Wow, those DDTs were really good. What the heck? So many dumb decisions were made in this game. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We got 2,000 XP for the super. Yo. Bala, thank you for the dono. Bench PR is 295 pounds. What is that in kilos? Because you probably do kilos. Because every other country does. Besides the US, because we're stupid. 133 kilos. Almost 134 kilos. I haven't maxed out in a very, very long time, though. I am not, like, I don't train for strength. I train for aesthetics. So for, like, how I look. Because I'm really not that strong. Like, I swear, I'm not that strong. But thank you again for the dono, bro. Got techno yet? I do not etiquette. I'm sorry. Like, I just didn't acknowledge that question. Or I think I said it and I just didn't answer. <laughs> but thank you for the dono. Yeah, I don't have that yet. I'm going to have to do another pin message. I don't want to use... Hold on. Let me get this down, though. Guys, we have won against... If we go against Dartlene ever... That would be so funny, actually. If we went against Dartlene every single game. That would be so funny. That would be so funny to me. You're saying you can't stab my neck? Nope. Sorry. They're not big, bro. They're really tiny. Define soon. Hopefully within the next few weeks, if not sooner. Yo, Gunnar, Jacol. I hope I said that kind of right. Thank you so much for the $12. What is your max in deadlift? I don't do deadlifts. I, I don't do them. If I had to guess... 115 kilos. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I haven't done deadlift in forever. I used to in high school, but in high school, I was a weakling. I know, Darlene, the most exciting thing I've ever seen in my life. Dude, I know. And it takes... KK, okay, okay, it takes a lot of skill, too. Okay, so I'll, I know, obviously, I'm being um sarcastic but the thing is last season like i was okay with dartling users because like literally everybody in hall of masters used it so like there was no way that you could beat it without using it pretty much technically you could but it would be very hard um and they're in hall of masters you know they're trying to get t100 t10 whatever the case may be they're trying to get a good ranking i understand but now that we're in a new season why the heck are people still using it so you'd rather keep your back that's nice Okay, I'm going to use Gwenny's ability here in a second. So, you'd rather keep your back. That's nice. Huh? I like my back. Oh, we're talking about deadlifts. Yeah. Deadlift's scary for your back. Gotta have a perfect technique. Yeah. I don't think my form would be bad. Because, like, I genuinely, like, I don't ego lift. Like, I don't... Like, I'm not trying to impress anyone at the gym. Like, I'm just there to work out and leave, you know? So, like, I wouldn't, like, throw on a crap ton of weight and just do terrible form. I'm, like, all for, like, really good form and, like, really good mind-muscle connection and, like, good reps, muscle contraction, all that. I'm all for that. I actually, I guess I, I, I tad bit. Uh, if we leak here, by the way, I'm okay with it. I don't really care. I'm just going to eco here with yellows. But, um, I, I guess I used to use a little bit too much weight on certain accessory movements. Um, like, let's say curls, for example. And, like, you know, I'd probably, like, kind of, like, use, like, momentum to, like, get up, you know, the curl. Or, yeah, <laughs> the dumbbell when I'm curling. Um, but, yeah, I, I've kind of tried to stray away from that a little bit. And, um, drop the weight on everything I've done. And really focus on just contracting the muscle, you know, the right way. 
So yeah. Because like really at the end of the day, no one cares like how much like you're doing at the gym. Like no one like they, they just don't care. I don't mean to be like sound harsh or like sound like a meme head for saying that. Um but yeah, like definitely don't like if you do like light weight on like accessory movements, like that's okay. If you have great form, like that's all that matters. Truly. Alright, so now these will be an issue. Oh, I thought he was sending me white balloons. I swear he just was. Oh, we have the reactor already? Okay, I did not expect to afford it that early. See, we played that really well, okay? So we only leaked five lives. We still have ice, and we didn't even have to go for a triple guns either. Sub ice is pretty good combo for a map like this. Yeah, I used to chase the big weights now, kind of getting wiser. And yes, yes. Guess it comes with age. 100%. 100%, dude. Yeah, all the respect to people that, like, do lift, lift for strength as well. Like, power lifters and stuff. Like, um, you know, that, like, care about their maxes and stuff. Like, that's awesome, bro. That's just personally not me. Like, I don't, like, really care about, like, numbers. I just want to go to the gym, be healthy, and uh, look good. Hey, Bull. I've seen a lot of success in Ninja, Ice, Alchemist with Ocean Oban. O24 is overtuned. Ninja Ice Alchemist with Ocean Oban. 024 is overtuned. 024 on what exactly? Yo, Trevor, thank you for the five. Um, Ninja Ice. That's an interesting combo. For sure. Alchemist. Hmm. So you probably have to go with Ice and then Ninja after. Ocean Oban is definitely one of the better heroes for sure. So yeah. That sounds pretty good. Thank you again for the dono, bro. He's going Spike Factory, okay? So I have a little bit more experience. Uh, I definitely have more uh, respect for people that go Spike Factory. It's still an S tier tower for sure, but at least it's not Sniper and Ninja. <laughs> at least it's not those. The numbers we care about are all on YouTube. Yes, dude. Give me all the views. <laughs> nah. No, but yeah. Like, I'm definitely, like, my main, like, thing in life is definitely, like, making my channel like more successful and stuff so yeah but you don't want to be like too into the numbers you know i kind of am at points but like sometimes you know like your channel like just falls off a bit like you get like 10 out of 10 videos like left and right it happens it's normal you can't like let it get to you you just gotta remember why you started in the first place and continue on grinding been a fan for a while now and i've been enjoying your videos a lot now recently with those new patch notes that have been released, what towers do you think are going to be meta? What's going to be the new meta? Looking handsome. Yo, Furious Crew, thank you so much for the 20. That's hype, bro. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, I heard Ice is low-key going to be meta. Um, I have to take like a good look at these again. Now, KK told me, he's a fellow YouTuber, he told me that Spike Factory is like pretty much just not going to be good anymore. So, that's a big rip for sure. Um, so definitely not Spike Factory. Uh, Village could definitely be a part of meta still. Because Village Homeland is just so good, bro. The ability is insane. Um, and now you can use the ability immediately, I guess. Which is cool. Um, hmm. Yeah, change Metal Freeze to Snap Freeze from BTP6. So, like, what's the big difference with that? Is Snap Freeze, like, super OP or something? Uh, Sniper is out of the picture, too, I think. Uh, the Supply Drop initial cooldown ability is now 20 seconds and it does not stall zomgs and all moab class balloons as long so that's good too um heard a lot of people saying also heli could be meta oh wait we're low-key struggling out here um are we not good <laughs> thankfully we had a lot of cash <laughs> that could have been bad Um, yeah, it's, 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 it's too early to tell, personally. I don't, I honestly just don't know. Uh, Super is still going to be up there, too. Knockback was increased. Dark Knight was barely increased. I feel like Super Monkey is still going to be a very solid tower. Banana Farm, dude. Ton of, tons of changes with Banana Farm. So we'll see how that goes, too. 
I'm excited. I, I should use the banana farm. I probably will wait, though, until the new update to use that. Because, like, right now, like, I probably just don't have a chance, really. 20 to 30 percent stronger. Wow, that's crazy. Village Untouched, very solid. Yes. Yeah, dude. Farms might be the new wave. Which is, like, good, because, like, I'm honestly, like, echoing every game. It gets kind of boring at times, you know? So, like, because farms are a huge part of BTD Battles 1. Boomer Sniper is super good. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. Got Boomer early game. My press as well. Sniper, of course, to get money. Best way to get money right now. And Super is a very solid late game tower. So, yeah. Sniper gives you so much money, dude. So, like, you'll be able to supply your defenses because Super Monkey is the most expensive tower in the game. Hopefully, the update comes out before my VIP runs out so I can grab the new towers. Ooh, yeah. We'll see when it comes out. My guess, everyone will ditch snipers for stronger eco like Druid, Farm, or Heli. Yeah, I've, I've seen a lot of people already starting to grind for Heli. Um, so, yeah. I'm going to have to try those ways of getting money, too. I do want to try. I, I want I want to try everything eventually, you know? But, yeah, dude. Also, too, they're adding a cash roll mode. I am so unbelievably hyped for that. Now, for, like, content... Like, I can use meme strats in casual mode and, like, not, you know, risk losing a trophy in a ranked match. That's so nice, dude. That's so, so nice. But sniper mid-game is also amazing. It's still, it's still gonna be good. Dang. Or well, I hope, like, People just don't use it as much because I'm just so tired of seeing it, to be honest with you. But casual mode is not in this update. No, you're joking, bro. Oh my god. One Professor Evil. Professor Evil would be a good addition, you know, like a daily challenge or a weekly challenge or whatever. Like they actually have it what twice a week on BT the Battles one. That would be really really cool, for sure. Now, how much is Embrittlement going to help me out, by the way? I normally upgrade to it, but, like, is it even worth the money? Like, it detects camo balloons and all balloons, but, like, we don't even need to worry about camo because we got Reactor, and then become Brittle, taking extra damage. Losing camo and regrow properties, but we already have sub for that. So, like, is it worth? I don't even know. I normally do it, but... Boat is a good way to get money. Yeah, Merchantman. I've never tried it. But I've heard good things about it. I mean, how well does he defend against DDTs, like, actually? Like, if I send him a few sets right now, like, he low-key would be, like, screwed. Maybe this, maybe that can scare him a little bit. No, he, oh, he got MAD. God, I just now saw that. <laughs> I just now saw it, okay? You don't have to facepalm me. <laughs> Dang. Uh, that is kind of unfortunate. Very unfortunate. <laughs> we'll see what we can do here. Uh, pff, I got no eco, bro. Oh my god, I'm so screwed. I didn't think he was going to have enough money to go for MAD. That's a 60k upgrade. How the heck? Where the heck did that money spawn from, bro? I am so incredibly screwed now. I am so screwed. I need to send him a... I can't even do it. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, I'm so screwed, bro. I mean, I'm not defending. Let's be real. We just gotta hope and pray that he does not counter me. He's tower boosting, alright, so that's a good sign, I guess. Oh, I'm so I'm so screwed. I am so screwed, bro. I'm gonna, I guess I'm gonna try to go for an ice, maybe. Oh my god, he's shredding. Wow! Spike Factory is so OP. Oh I tower boosted. I did not mean to do that. <gasps> wait, wait, wait! Please balloon boost! Get out of here! Get out of here! Oh my god! No shot, dude! I want to see some W's in the chat, man. There, I cannot believe I just won that. Wow. 
All he had to do was just all out of the DDTs. I was screwed. GG's, man. I only have 45 trophies. I am freaking selling hard. Easy dubs. Easy dubs, boys. Yeah, so like, Super Brittle, is it worth? That's what I've been trying to go for, but like, I don't know. People have been saying Icicle could be good. I, I don't know. Let me know. Let me know which one I should go for. Dude, that was freaking sick, dude. Let's go, man. VIP is so OP. Yeah, we just got a ton of XP right there for sure. Feel nature's rock. Do you ever miss Ultra late game? Now, when you say Ultra, what do you mean? Exactly. Super Brittle allows all towers to deal 5 plus damage to all blimps in range. Works well with fast attacking towers like Taxone. Ooh, gotcha. So, like, with this strategy, then it wouldn't really help me. Too much, I guess. I don't know. Oh, he's going nice too. You love to see it. This is oh my god, this is gonna be the first game that my opponent did not use Dartling, unless he's just not starting off with it. Wow, good job, Cyan Rabbit 1219. I appreciate that. Thank you. Would help with Super, but eh, okay, gotcha. I'm not gonna go for it then. I'm trusting you, KK. Should I go for Icicle Impel then? Or should I go Middle Path? I don't even have 4th tier unlocked on the bottom path, but if I need to start going for that, I will. Alright, let's do that. I look like a Chad. Is that a compliment? Chad. <laughs> Dark Mastery, he's flexing. Oh. Oh, I was tabbed out. Oops. Oh my god! He's going, he's going the same strat. Let's go. See, now, could we actually be better here? Or it could be, actually. Yeah. I don't normally go for reactor there. I normally go for it right here, but maybe it will be better right here. I don't know though. Because he went for his sub there, so that's kind of why I wanted to do that. Super Brutal up front. It allows any balloons to destroy Frozens. Also, Impaler is my favorite tower in the game. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. You're not going to use either upgrade yet, so what? So whatever. Oh, okay. Ice is just not that good yet. I heard that Icicle Impale could be good in the next update. I don't know. I just read some comments on Reddit, bro. I'm just trusting randoms. <laughs> I don't even know like who these people are. I'm just like, okay, yeah, they're saying that's going to be good, so it must be, right? <laughs> so we're going to want this on last then, right? I'm okay with thinking that. Wow. Targeting with the sub low-key kind of works. Yeah, dude, when I have it on first, it's terrible. Oh my god, this is so much better. I'm okay with a few leaks here and there. That's okay with me. Maybe I should go for triple. If I continue consistently leaking here. He went for triple. He's fully defending, too. And he did go- he put it on last, too. This guy knows the strats. He knows the strats. Oh, that's not the right button. Oh, this is you, bro? Good luck. Hee <laughs> hee. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, we're actually going to need triple. Yeah, let's just do it for it then. I guess, okay, so we'll go for triple next time. We could have actually conserved all of our lives, I guess. But it's okay, because this game's not going around 40, but... All right, I'm so copying your freaking um, sub spot from now on, bro. This spot's amazing, dude. What the heck? All right, start spacing them now. Top path is the bad path. Really? 
Interesting. Okay, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to try it out. I'll unlock the forts here after this game. All right, so he's going for her reactor right next to his other sub. All right, I'm gonna low-key copy you, bro. Nope, just kidding. It was my idea first. It was 100% always my idea. <laughs> he's also equal with blues. What a little freaking copier, bro. <laughs> I'm playing with you, bro. <laughs> this is actually you. I'm just messing around. <laughs> That was almost really bad. Good thing my reaction time is just too freaking good. <laughs> I'm playing. What's up, Kevin? How's it going, dude? What about Boomer Ice Sub? Yeah, like, Boomer Ice Sub's, like, it's good, but then, like, once you hit round 26, you can't, you're not defending DDTs. At least I don't think. It would be quite tough. Finally unlocked Ocean Open today. Well, congratulations. Are you going to be doing any tutorials on BTD Battles 2? I'm looking for an early game loadout without needing to grind to upgrade too many towers. Yeah, dude. I mean, I have so many videos on BTD Battles 2. Like, I am constantly giving, like, tips and stuff uh, within those videos. Are we good against that? Oh my god, bro. No, no, no. Did Gwen's ability just save my life or what? <laughs> Did that just save my life or what? This forces. Oh, he's going super two. Yeah, he's going the same exact thing. Thanks All right, he's gonna ta tower boost question, that. Dude. I'm kind of surprised that Oban didn't get nerfed. Keep up the great work, and I'm excited to see what you do next. Yeah, I, I, I try to answer it as best as I could. I'm sorry, but I appreciate it, man. Thank you so much for the five dollars again. That's thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, hopefully Oban gets nerfed. Oban is just a different breed bro oh my god why is round 17 taking so long i'm gonna have to tower boost this i might be dead i'm so dead right i'm so dead why is this so bad I guess I should have went for super. Oh my god, that was terrible. Wow. That was so terrible. What? With the tower boost and everything, bro? GG's. Yeah, okay. Okay, we're learning. We're we're learning, okay? Uh, I'm not... Wow, ballistic missile is terrible. Wow, bottom path dirt. Their sub is terrible. Jesus. Oh my god. It's so bad. It's just so bad. <laughs> it was so terrible. Yeah, I hope Ocean Open. I hope Open in general just gets really hard nerfs, bro. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, no. Oh, no. I can't use this strategy on this map. I'm telling you right now. It is terrible on this map. I normally just switch over to Ace and Meme, kind of. So yeah, we'll do it. <laughs> it's sub super monkey boomerang good. Sounds like it, William. By the way, if you guys are new to the stream, welcome. Make sure to click that subscribe button, alright? Yes, I did just catch an L, but trust me, I I'm not that bad. It's just these towers really aren't that good. I'm, I'm not claiming I'm the greatest either, though, at the same time, okay? So don't get it twisted, but... These towers are just really not all that. But not, they're not completely terrible. So, yeah. You're going to get that one life off of me, bro? 
is what you thought. <laughs> I'm going for sub. I don't even care. Just because you went for Dartlene. You don't get the first blood that easily. Oh, he's going farms? Shouldn't he be anti-stalling then? I don't know. He's a little bit too busy, I guess, defending against these reds. Hee <laughs> hee. Uh-oh, those blues in there. Is he going to leak? Is the young man going to end up leaking to those? Yes, he is. We did, in fact, get first blood. That's probably my first time ever getting first blood with this strategy. Everyone's still abusing Darlene? Yeah. Yeah. At least he's farming. At least, we'll, we'll, give him the, we'll give him that. He's farming. If you're rich, become a channel member. If you're broke, just subscribe. Facts. Oh, my man out here is struggling. But yeah, if you're new to the stream, make sure also to drop a like. We're trying to hit 1,000 likes. Currently at 715. That means we're 285 away. Quick maths, bro. Quick. Quick. We're quick with it. And also, too, we're less than 500 subscribers away from 294 subscribers. Or 294,000 subscribers, sorry. Um, currently 468 away. Dude, my math is just too good, bro. Ah, ah, all right. So we will go for trip guns. Seems to be the way. <gasps> You're sending me yellows. How dare you? How how dare you? So we're also going to put this bad boy on last. I don't know. Sub on last. Be OP, though. All right, wait. Okay, whatever. Whatever, whatever. It's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Do we even need to go for barbed? Okay, yeah, we do. Now we should be chilling. And also, too, at least he's using Gwen. Which T5 should I get on sub? Mm. Preemptive. I guess. I guess preemptive is going to get a huge buff too in the next update, so I'll just go preemptive, which is middle path. Ooga booga, how much would you have to donate for a collab? You don't have to donate me for a collab, bro. We can we can do a video for your channel. I'm down. Just message me in the YouTuber server. Mad getting buff doesn't seem right. Yeah, is it? Is it actually getting buffed? Wow, sub on last bro is like the way for like most maps. Like this is actually crazy. If I had this thing on first, we'd be struggling out here. And dude, look at my eco for Glade. I have 900 eco. You're joking, bro. This is insane. Boomer is good in every path, but bottom is good for laps. Top is good for regular balloons. Yes, sir. All right, we're going to go for this bad boy. Mm. All right, now we're kind of struggling. Struggle lugging, then. Is that the thing that SJB says? Hydra. Fair play. Owie, that hurts. I don't know how the heck we got him down that low, by the way. All right. We actually have an insane amount of eco for Glade. This is crazy. Dang it. Maybe I should have went super, bro. Shoot. Normally, I do super bad on this map, but, like, clearly targeting the freaking sub is the thing that I needed to do. Let's get into BTD6 mad DPS. Wow. So, like... Matt is like definitely the best then. Best fit tier on the Darling. That's crazy. Incredible. Please play 0 1 2 ice next round. Why? Why that ice? Yo, Ooga Booga, thank you for the five. You, I told you you had to donate, bro. I appreciate it, dude. Let's go for a middle path. 
I don't know. Let's just do it. Maybe we didn't need it. Definitely not, actually. He's just spamming farms, by the way. I'm assuming he's just grinding XP for him. And honestly, we fit in a struggle. I kind of want to get some ace XP, I guess. What should I go for on ace, guys? Um, my god, dude. This is not optimal. I'm going to go for ace over here, I guess. Get that out of the way. Does this affect the ace? No, it doesn't. Oh. Duh, it's above. What was I thinking? 203, 202. Okay. Right. I don't trust y'all. We're going we're gonna to go for that. We'll go for never miss, yeah. Because I don't know how well we're going to defend against mobs, dude. We're actually probably screwed, right? Oh, and he's going Spike Factory? Dude, Dartling Spike Factory. Mm. Mm. I'm going to go for never miss. I've never used this upgrade. We'll see how it does. Oh, God. Oh, God. Is it going to do good against this? Or no? Okay, I went for wrong path, too. Dude. Come on. Come on. Come on. The sub is so terrible. It's so bad. It's so bad. It's so terrible. I can't rush him, dude. No, man. Oh, it's just so bad. I didn't know. I thought the ace would help me out a little bit more right there. It didn't. I don't think it did very much. Uh, that's okay, though. All right, next time, next time we know we can go, we can actually go, we can go sub by super on that map. I've just had past experiences where it ended really poorly for me. Fighter plane does extra damage to my apps. Oh, I just listened to somebody in chat, bro. They just said two zero three. So I was like, all right, bet bro, we're going to do it. Yeah. Oh my god, of course! Whoever said 203, I'm coming to get ya. Not actually, okay? It's a joke. <laughs> of course, I always do the wrong upgrades, bro. It's like, it's either one or the other, and I always do the wrong one. Dang it. Alright, it's fine. We've got this. Got this! Let's go! Starting off with the ninja. That's a interesting play. All right, someone told me to go bottom path. I'll do it for you. Attacks faster and freezes for longer. Okay, so we want that. And larger freeze area. Let's do it. It was... <laughs> Guys, it's okay. <laughs> it's no one's fault but mine. Is he just... Is he just XP farming? If so, I'm trying to get down my freaking... Actually, I don't need XP for the sub. Bro, you don't have to give me the win. I prefer you not. I've made some minor modifications. If you go for that, get refreeze. Okay, let's do it. Yeah, I don't really mess with bottom path. I need to unlock the forts here. I forgot to do that. I have enough XP for it too. I just forgot to do it. Ninja NG Ice. NG's really solid i honestly should probably be grinding for that because like double xl trap or triple xl trap i'm sorry that defends literally infinite dbt's how oh i'm like i'm still sending res bro love the webcam thank you flappy appreciate that man thank you owie don't send me those that's so mean i'm gonna leak because gwenny can't pop oh she took that personal she was like yes i can can you? Gwendolyn is going in for me. Oh, no. We leaked that. We leaked that for sure. No shot. We didn't. <laughs> we're just too good. We're, we're just literally too good. All right. So, when I want to put this on last now. Oops. Okay. Okay. Also go for Barb. All right, I'm leaking that. I need to go. Maybe I shouldn't have went for Barb. I don't know. Like, I think Barb's the play for early game, but... Gwenny? Okay, at least we got first blood, I guess. <laughs> I don't know how we did, because he has a ricochet boomer right there. I look like the bully from sex education. I don't see that as a compliment, bro. 
I don't know who the heck you're talking about. We should make a back face off vid before it gets nerfed. Dude, let's do it. I'm down. Let's do it, bro. So I will go for triple. I remember the, the guy in the last game when we played against him, he went for this. So hopefully this is the play. I can't believe this guy literally started off with Ninja. I guess you can get away with it. I mean, he ended up ultimately also going for Ricochet. He should have just went for Boomer first. He must just be grinding XP for his uh, Ninja. At least that's what I'm assuming. Sounds good, I'll DM you. For sure. Yeah, let's do it. I'm always down, bro. Spike Factory, yes. Spike Factory is amazing. Try Druid. Now, I heard someone say that they they had Druid Mastery, and they're like, Boltrix, I unlocked every fit tier for Druid. It's terrible, but you should eventually try it out. <laughs> I was like, okay, noted, thanks. I feel like it's not that bad. Is Superstorm good? I remember using that in early access. Oh. Hey, why are you sending me leads? I got Gwenny for that. How well does he defend against like Camel Purples per se? Like not that well, right? I'm assuming not. Or like even like camo rainbows or something. Or is that is that too expensive? Why did that tower or that balloon boost take so long, bro? GG's. I don't know why that took so long. He could have rushed me, by the way. I never went for reactor. Nice to see you don't use ninja sniper dartling like everyone else. Yeah, dude. Ooga booga, like, dude, I, I don't want to use meta because, like, I already got what I wanted with um, Season 1. I'm, I'm only at 44 trophies. Oh, my God, that's so bad, guys. I got the top 100 batch, which, you know, a little flex. But that that was my goal. I just wanted to get that badge. And, you know, for the first season ever on BT Battles 2, like, I was, like, one of the top 100 players. Like, that's cool to say, in my opinion. So, yeah. But now, my 50, 52 days, 52 days, 11 hours. I have no intentions of making a push to Hall of Masters anytime soon. So, like, why would I use meta if I, like, don't necessarily care about my trophy count right now? You know? There's just no point. All right. We got that for tier now. So, we need 30,000 XP? Okay. We can, we can manage that. 17k. I don't know. Like, what should I go for on Super, guys? Tech Terror? Sun Temple or Dark Champion? I heard Dark Champion's, like, not good because it's better to just spam Dark Knights. That's what I heard, though. You have multiple badges displayed. Oh, you know, that makes sense. Because, like, look at, like, its position. And, you know, it kind of, like, looks awkward. So, I guess. Wait, so, like, I wonder if you get, like, another top 100. If it's just, like, going to show two top. Okay, we're going to play on this map, by the way. If it's going to show two top 100 badges. Or since you already got a top 100 badge, it's just not going to show another one. I don't know. There's a little one above this. So, maybe that is this... Um, symbolizes season one so maybe it's gonna be different so you can have another top 100 I don't know because like honestly that will probably be my goal again I don't know like making a push for top 10 bro that would be like it, I think it's doable no but if you get top 10 it will be separate gotcha like, top 10 is po I think it's possible if I just abuse whatever meta is currently the meta but, like, that would be very time-consuming and also very stressful. Uh, so, I don't know if I'll ever actually try to push for that, to be honest with you. Because, like, I don't want to, like, make the game, like, me... Oh, oh my god. I clicked the wrong button. <laughs> but I don't want to make, like, me playing this game a chore, you know? Oh, I should have went for bottom path. Oops, sorry, guys. But I don't want to make me playing this game a chore. So, like, I don't know if I want to do that try to go for top 10 because like that would be very stressful like I, I i could already see myself raging a lot i'm 
then get top 50% to have all three. Yeah, that'd be cool. Top three is worse. You don't like the blue one? I, I kind of like the blue one. It's kind of like similar to what it is in BT Devils 1, but... Yeah, I don't know. I don't think I would ever try to make a push for top three. Definitely not top three. Top 10 would be like, eh. I don't know. It just all depends. Because, like, for example, you made to, like, what? Like, you were, like, top 35 or something at one point, right? And you only had played a few games in Hollow Masters. So, if I just, like, joined, like, one of the last days for it and just, like, had really, like, a really good, like, first few games and I was, like, top, like, 40s, maybe I would make a push for Hall of Masters. Or, I mean, sorry, top 10. <laughs> But then again, it would be late in the season, so. What's up, Swindle? The game crash glitch? Great. Luckily, I haven't had to go against that yet. Bike Factory, Heli, Engineer. Heli's gonna get a buff. NG, I don't know, I can't remember. And then Heli, I mean, Spike Factory is gonna receive a nerf, but Spike Factory right now is pretty good, so yeah. I like that strat. It's cool, it's different. Anything with the spike factory, bro, of course, is wonderful. I'm just gonna put this on last now before I forget. Ninja, Ninja's Village. I know, dude. Eventually, I want to use that. Maybe not this, like, update, though. I have yet to grind for the ninja. I don't want to use it in its broken state. Oh, my God. Poor guy. You definitely did not need a tire boost that. <laughs> definitely did not need to. You already have a Darlene and a Glaver Cachet. Saw your video earlier. Substrat was one of my favorites in BTP6. Oh, really? Oh, cool. You know the sad story about top 10 hackers? Yeah. DFA? Yeah. I want to try, like, meta strategies that were meta in BTP Battles 1 and BTP Battles 2. I think that would be a really cool idea and fun video. I got scared. <laughs> I got really scared, so I just went instantly for triple guns. Uh, I, I might leak here. It's okay. I I'm okay with leaking. You got your first bits here today for the Dartling. Nice. What'd you go for? Did you end up going for the MAD? I hope so. MAD is by far the best bit here. And it's going to get receive a buff, so. Is Meta getting nerfed? Yes. They're going to fix the uh, sticky bomb stacking on the Ninja and then the laser shock Dartling bug as well. So, And also, two Sniper will receive a nerf. So I guess like Glade is a shorter map. Really? Should I tower boost this? I'm okay with I, if he wants first blood that badly, like go go for it. I think I should conserve my tower boost for like mobs and stuff. I'm surprised he did that. I'm gonna start space equaling now. It's about to be round nine, yeah. Ninja farm mortar and BT battles too. Oh yeah, I remember when that was pretty good. Sub commander with a bunch of APD subs. What's APD? Works wonders combined with ice. Really? Impale? Really? Dude, I need to go for that then. For sure. That's what I'm gonna go. To. That's what I'm gonna go for. You like village a lot? Yeah, village is pretty awesome, dude. I actually love the village. Just enhances all your towers, makes them a lot better. It's amazing. Dude, okay, so like we've kinda we do a lot better now with this strategy. Like, I'm learning every single game more about the strategy because like i'm still a bot when it comes to the strategy i mean i'm a bot in general but i'm getting a lot better with the strategy for sure i think the main issue was i didn't target this sub when i whenever i would set down a sub i wouldn't target them so they would just really chase hard to the balloons and it's just not optimal on first on dino in this map last and on castle ruins all targeted last sub is op Casual mode, use glue ice potion. Oh, of course, Professor. 100%. Dude, I, I've got a troll too, bro. Like, le let's say, like, I make it in the Hall of Masters for a season. I've got a troll maybe and, like, use glue <laughs> in Hall of Masters or something, bro. That'd be crazy. Can't be a bot. No, KK. I think I got lucky. I got lucky, bro. That was early within the game, too. Super early within the game. See, like, I don't really need to go for middle path right there. I think that's kind of just a waste of money. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. 
So yeah, going for Ballistic Missile, by the way, with this next upcoming update will actually be worth it because it's actually going to do a lot more damage to Mild Class Wounds and Ceramics. But right now, Ballistic Missile is not the way to go. This freaking upgrade is terrible, actually. So I guess I'm just going to go for a Super like right here. And, oh, I have like no money. That's not good. But I still will remove that. And I should probably go for at least a 101, right? So he could send me around 17 mob. He's fine. Now, Fortify mob, he's not fine, actually. Boomer Ninja. Interesting strategy. Well, I didn't have first strike, but still. Ballistic is trash now. I know, dude. It's so terrible. I actually might even sell this ice for a few extra dollars. He went for Sabo? Bruh. What? Why? Why the heck did he go for Sabo? <laughs> that is quite interesting. Now, Fortified. How well do we defend against Fortified? Probably not that well. Maybe I shouldn't be egoing here. I mean, currently he's egoing, so. Sub Commander is so cheap is because you need a bunch of 004 subs in combo for the fits here to be good. Oh, so I used it kind of wrong then in the video. Yeah, I guess I should have went for more of those then. I went for a preemptive. There's no shot I was defending against that. See, I kind of did want to rush him too with Fortified here because, yeah, he is Boomer. So, more press OP. And also too, because he has a Sabo. Like, what? For round 19, it has a Sabo? I mean, he even got it up on round 17. Like, that's actually crazy, dude. Prince of Darkness for Wizard. Dude, I want to get all the tiers and I want to make videos on all of them. Because, like, see, like, Prince of Darkness. That's been in BTD6. I could not tell you what that is. Like, I don't even know what the heck it does. Like, so it's, like, it's cool and exciting for me. Because, like, I just genuinely don't even know what it is. So, like, it's just really awesome. He's got more press. Dude, it's not even worth to send him like a BFB. Even a fortified ZOMG. Maybe he would actually struggle to a fortified. I'm not going to do it though. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. Because you know the one thing he's going to struggle to? DDTs. Incredible. Round 17 Sabo is unprecedented. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, thank you, Etiquette. Appreciate it. Yeah, dude. He was just being safe. Thank you for your patience. Good play. Round 17 Sabo is unprecedented. Is he really sending me purples? What is this? Send me the ZOMG. You you won't dare do it. Now it's a fortified ZOMG. Like, what should I do against a fortified ZOMG? I don't know. Fortified ZOMG, like, I normally try to micro first strike, but with the cooldown and everything, I can't one pop it. Maybe I should go for a Dark Knight and then first, first strike. I don't really know. Gotta learn how to do that. I play super only. I like to see when the nubs will realize I don't have camo purple defenses. Usually it takes them a few rounds. That's actually hilarious. Like, I need to do like stuff like that, dude. Like, I'm just trying to troll this season, bro. But towards the end, I do want to make a push for Hall of Masters. So that would be like towards the end of February. So like, that's not for a very, very, very long time. So don't need to worry about that. Which, of course, is awesome. Let's go for Dark Knight now. I guess. Could also go for, like, uh, this right here. Have a Snowstorm. Snowstorm ability freezes all balloons on screen, briefly freezes wide zebra camo and mob class. Okay. So just like it is, I think it freezes two layers, correct? If I'm not mistaken. He's not currently equaling at us, by the way. He might be a mobile user then. One of the best combos would be sub ice out. Someone creeps. Dude, somebody actually said that earlier. So, since whenever I had a face cam, I got a face cam for Christmas. By the way, if you guys are new to the stream, welcome. My name is Boltrix. We do BTD Battles 2 here on the channel. So, drop a subscribe. Does that make sense? Click that subscribe button <laughs> if you're new. You got to subscribe anyway to chat in the chat, so might as well do it. 
and you won't regret it. We're trying to hit 294,000 subscribers by the end of the day. We're currently 410 away. Let's do it. And also, to drop a like. We're currently 130 likes away from 1,000 likes, which is pretty hype. All right. Go for some more Dark Nighties. All right. Three Dark Nighties. Perfect, though. I don't, like, should I go for another one back here? I don't know. I don't really know. He can't defend DDTs that well, correct? He got turbocharged, too. He must be scared. He has so many ninjas, bro. Like, he is so over-defending right now. Like, this is crazy, man. Am I going to make videos with face cam? Possibly from here and there. What's up, Michael? Smash that like. Expect. Yes. KK, isn't it really late where you live? Or no? Yes, dude. Wizard's going to be more usable. That is awesome, man. I'm so hyped, bro. Alright, so I have 5100 eco for Glade. Like, that is nuts. What? I don't think I've ever hit that much, to be honest with you. Should I DDT rush him? What do you guys think? Subscribe, no, don't know, yes. Shout out to Jexo Gaming. Shout out to Jexo Gaming. Thank you for the $2, dude. DDTs, yes or no? Yes or no, yes or no, yes or no. Subscribe, no, don't know, yes. Shout out to Jexo Gaming. Rush him. Okay. All right, all right, all right. I mean, it's on three sets right now, so let's try it out. Oh, sorry, two sets. Oh, yeah, he's dead. GG's. Or is he? Oh, yep. Let's go, baby! Let's go, dude! Sunrise is actually good on that map! Sunrise Super, let's go, dude! Let's say I went to sleep after your stream. Gotcha. It's like one, oh, 125. Dang. Let's go, dude. I can't believe I'm so sorry. I I shouldn't be this low. 45 trophies though. That, that's kind of bad for me. I won't even lie. Ooh, one times XP for an hour. You love to see it. Yo, David Bowman. Thank you so much for the $20, man. Finally able to make a stream. Dude, I'm doing well. How are you, man? Thank you so much. That's so kind of you. I'm at the gym getting them gains. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you so much again, bro. I really appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, DDTs were definitely the play right there. 100%. Because obviously, uh, Boomer can't detect. And then Ninja is not that good against DDTs. He was preparing so hard, too. That's so funny. I finished rank 89th. I could have gotten higher, but I didn't want to risk it. So I just... Just played it safe. Alright, let's go for this bad boy ice up here. Oh, yeah. I should go bottom path. I keep on forgetting that. I'm sorry, guys. Maybe I'll go for, like, bottom path ice. Ooh. Yo, that ice spot is low-key goaded. Now this had the tendency to over-defend like crazy. Yeah. Show me show the setup. Okay. Let's do it. It's nothing too crazy. Shut up, Gwendolyn. I'm just kidding, Gwendolyn. I'm sorry. He's number three last season. Look at his badge. Wait, this guy was? This guy's a number three? No, he's not. No shot. I don't remember his name like that. Alright, so, sub is terrible on this map, first of all. I'm not even going to go for longer range. I'm just going to go for barbed. 
I think it's better early game. I just can't. <laughs> it just can't hit this path right here. Like, are you kidding me, bro? Like, NK, why'd you have to do it like that, bro? Come on. Really scuffing these water towers here. They need, like, a more... Like, they need, like, a smaller water map. Or shorter, sorry. They need a shorter water map. There is no short water map. Like, mainly water. Isn't this the guy you played against in your recent video? Is it? Um, I don't know. So, if we put this on last, though, it's gonna target. Yeah, it's gonna target those ones. Maybe I should put it on close or strong, maybe. We'll do that. Let's see how it does. Oh, it's doing terrible. Maybe we need to go for that. That's why. Last is not the play. All right, maybe this is the play. It's still not that good. It's just Plutonium Mines sub is not that good. Once we get past these trickier rounds and have a reactor and everything, we'll be absolutely chilling. We're doing better than what we normally do, though, so I'll take that. He's going Ice Boomer Village, I believe. Ooh. Oh. You were wrong. He's going Ninja Boomer Ice. <laughs> Close, though. Do you think Tax Super Sniper is a good strategy? Yeah, because Tax is still solid. You can have that for early. S sniper is the best way to get money. And then Super is a good late game tower. So, yeah, I do think that's good. I just saw Super Sniper as a good strat. Thank you for the $2, though. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, maybe I over a tad bit. I remember Reactor is terrible on this map. Newsflash, it's terrible. I hope this guy's not watching me, though. He's like, oh, it's terrible? Let me rush in mid-game, then. Because, man, oh, man, it's bad. It's just so terrible on this map. Are we struggling out here? We are indeed. We have nowhere near enough money to go for reactor either. That's not a good look for us. He's still sending purple balloons? Bro, get out of here, bro. How you defend camos? Camelettes. Oh, oh, shoot. Get out of here, bro. Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Please tell me we defend that, right? Please tell me we defend that, right? God sub, you suck. God sub, you're so bad. I can't. Oh, that's flash bomb? No shot, it is. I didn't know that. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, guys. I'm so dead. Oh, yep, I'm dead. GG's. Oh, we're actually fine. I don't know how. We're at nine lives, bro. What can I do to this man? Oh my god. All right, so I'm gonna end up selling this and then like rushing with like, I don't know, like a camo rush kinda. He's dead to that, right? Wow. <laughs> dude, I played that. Oh my God, sub is not good on that map, dude. But like, man, I almost choked that. GG's only though. Guys, I'm so sorry. I didn't know there was a flash bomber. I gotta like learn what like certain upgrades and stuff look like. <laughs> I still don't know. <laughs> wow, I got 3,000 XP for the sub. Thankfully, I just totally need that. Finally, a patch. What are you most hyped for out of all the notes? OFC, the meta nerf. I love to. Yo, David, thank you so much for the five dollars, David Avila. I appreciate that. Uh, what's the most exciting thing? Um, definitely what you just said. But if I had to say something else, I think, honestly, um, how they're going to remove, like, late game maps out of Hall of Masters and ZOMG. So, that is awesome, dude. I'm really hyped about that. So, gonna, they're going to remove Plutonium Mines, Mayan, and Docks. And they're going to add shorter maps eventually, too. So, not with this next update. The next one, though, after that. I don't know why I'm going to Spike Factory, by the way. Um, but, yeah, I'm so hyped about that, man. 
Thank you so much for the dono. I appreciate that. I'm going to try to go for Icicle Impel. I think this is my best bet from what I've seen in chat for the most part. Are you sticking with these towers for 1.0.6? Uh, yes. Yes. I think so. We'll, we'll see, like, Boris, thank you, first of all. Uh, we're we're going to see, like, what's good. I'm going to play on Glade. We're going to see what's good um, once this next update comes out. Because, like, the pros, they're going to figure out what meta is, you know. So, we'll, we'll see. But I guess for the most part, yeah, I'll try to stick with this strategy. Um, but if there's a better strategy that prevails, then I'll start grinding XP for whatever tower or towers it involves. They also need to remove brick map. Oh, yeah. In the wall, bro. I always hard pass that. That's, I, that's my least favorite map for sure. I agree. Play sub a bit back because darts spawn behind balloons. Darts spawn what? Yo. Thank you for the $2, first of all. I'm going to go for the um, bottom path again. Try it out. Because, like, guys. Die. Freaking, um... Whatchamacallit. I forget. Ice Shard's not going to help me out on this map. It just won't. He's going tack, though, and he's going to leak lives, baby. Thank you for your patronage. <laughs> Place sub a bit back. DC darts spawn behind blooms. Gotcha. Noted. Thank you. Um, so, yeah. I normally go with sub back here now, and I just set it to last. And it worked out really well the last time we played on this map. So, leave the meta figure into us. Yes, dude. I literally, like, with, like, when it comes down to, like, where I place down towers and stuff, like, I leave it to the pros. <laughs> like, oh, this is the best dartling position. I'm like, okay, bet. <laughs> I listen to y'all. And, like, I adapt my, my, uh, placements and stuff. Because, like, let's say, like, right now, I don't know, let's say, like, Gwendolyn is, like, good. Let's say, like, this exact strategy that I'm using right now is meta next season. And people don't send Gwendolyn here. I'll set a, I'll set her uh, wherever they end up sending her. You know what I mean? See what the good players are doing, and then base your game around that because they're good for a reason. Mason T Y T. This is you. Oh, good luck, bro. This actually is you because this guy's named Mason. Sick. You forgot refreeze. Oh, like should I get like refreeze really early? I'll do it. This guy's a top three batch. No, he does not. <laughs> that's a that's a lie, bro. I remember like no top three name was named Mason. Oh, is he gonna struggle with space flights? Oh no, he. Wow, you went for another one of those. That's ultra safe. Respect. Refreeze is good early game. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay, so like, for a map like this, should I just go for Cryo Cannon? Or should I just not even do that? Is like, is that not even worth it? Dart projectiles from sub spawn at the tip of the gun, so balloons that are too close to it won't be popped. Gotcha. Well, thank you for letting me know that. I did not know that. You learn something new every day is what my dad would say. You do, in fact. Just try it out. Okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll do that later. Yeah, because I have not really used that. At all. I think I'm actually... I think I've upgraded to it a few times, but that's about it. Who's going sub to? Hey, Mason, if you're listening, I appreciate that you're not going dart lane. <laughs> that is an interesting spot. Wow, that is super interesting. So I guess like I'll just stop echoing towards like the start of round nine. So yeah, just now we'll... Or stop, like, group decoing with yellows. And then I'll start space decoing with blacks. And, yeah. And then we'll go for our reactor up here. I'm super surprised to see that he went for that in the back. We could leak here, by the way. 
He might. I probably am going to. So far, we're fine. Oh, he's going Alk! This guy's using Alk! Swindle, bro. <laughs> now, not exactly what we were talking about, but pretty similar. He's just going Alk and Reactor. How much better is he going to make that Reactor? Have I attempted your favorite battles one try to use that? No. I don't even I haven't even touched a ninja at all. I'm currently grinding ice, so maybe after I grind the ice and get all the fifth tiers, I could go for ninja. Mid game rush is dead. See, like, yeah, I was gonna ask, like, purple balloons, like. Like, is he screwed with purples or no? Like right now he's disintegrating freaking yellows, so. And he doesn't have middle path on that either. He's also got Tashidor, okay. I was about to say, maybe I could rush him with Space Ceramics, but... Would that even be worth? I wonder if I should stay up late for us to place back. Uh, I probably won't end for quite some time. So, we should probably just do it another time, honestly. So you can get some sleep, because it's pretty late for you. Ninja's really good? Yeah, it's one of the best. Mm-hmm. Rainbows. Now, the only issue is with me... Okay, well, definitely not going to do that now. I was going to say, he has Taxter too, so he could just Maelstrom against any rush. So, yeah. Definitely not going to do that now, because he already has the Maelstrom ready to go. So, yeah, we won't be doing that. What we will be doing is going for this. I'm going to sell that, so we get that out of the way. Imagine a hero for the game, its ability and name. Like, think of one? Boltrix. I don't know. Yo, thank you for the two, though, Pikachu. Okay, maybe tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, we'll figure it out. Uh, I'm gonna go for knockback. Yeah. Hopefully that's the play. Maybe I'm eking on a little bit too hard here, too. But he's not punishing me for it, so... I guess we're fine. Now, how would he hold up against the mob, though? Let's see. Just a single mob. Kind of want to see how he reacts. He does have Maelstrom, but that's pretty much all he has to pop that down. He's going to end up getting up out. He's going to get up another attack shooter. He's going to end up using a Maelstrom, getting an overdrive as well, and that was able to defend. Well done. Now, I kind of want to see how he does against that. No shot. I'm defending so poorly against that. I think he's dead first anyway. Jesus. Wow. What was I supposed to do against that? Yo, Mason. GG's, man. But what the heck was I supposed to do to defend against that? Maybe I should not have been constantly ecoing then then uh, with those yellows. Wow, that was crazy. GG's. Check message on Discord. Name is Big Bill D67. Yo, thank you for the $2, man. Yo, W's in the chat, though, for the dub, all right? We've been catching dubs left and right. We're at, like, what, 43 trophies at one point or something? We're actually doing pretty well so far, so happy about that. Um, Yeah, I'll check your message, man, but I do not accept normally friend requests on Discord. I'm sorry. It's just, like, my DMs get too flooded. I can check out your message. Spike Factory is OP as heck. Yes, sir. So, yeah, in the wall. Terrible. Eh! Blech. He read it up. Get out of here. At least I think he read it up. Like, I don't know. Oh my god, no. Dude, I'm not even kidding, guys. Ice is... I think Ice is terrible on this map, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, thank the lord that he skipped it. Docs! Epic late game, baby! <laughs> I'm actually down. Like, I like going past round 30 because I like to test the limits with my strategy. Now, I haven't done so well so far, so... I need to stay, I, I need to figure out like still what the best way to defend against BADs is. I've been trying the Dark Knight spam, but I don't know. It's kind of tough out here. I'm doing that. I gotta head out for a bit to help a friend. I'll come back later. All right, Swindle, you're good, bro. Take care, man. Thank you for coming out in the first place. I appreciate it, dude. Top three badge. I swear to God, bro. I swear. 
Why are you in the top 100? Is it? Uh, it's a glitch, I think. It's, I'm not actually in the top 100 because I'm not in Hollow Masters. Clearly, I'm in Ledge Dungeon. Just saw that. I'm gonna try to remind myself to go bottom path and then go for a refreeze. Let's do it. Space Blues. I heard, yeah, I think bottom path, is, like, bottom and, bottom and middle path is better to defend against Blues. I think. I think that's what somebody said. Ice super underrated. Yes, and it's gonna receive a buff. Oh! You see this, man? Gotta go for Gwenny. Or can we defend against Reens? <laughs> we can. Dude, oh my god, bottom path is way better. Yo, thanks guys for putting me on about this. He's gonna send me space yellows though. That's so rude. Don't you dare. Don't you dare think about it. Don't you dare think about it. <laughs> Yo, by the way, we did hit a thousand likes. Oh my god, thank you guys so much for dropping the likes. If you still have yet to, make sure to drop a like. And I'm checking the sub count right now. Because I'm kind of curious on how many subs we got. He's going healthy, by the way. Props to him. Ooh! We're 337 subscribers away from hitting 294,000 subscribers. So, if you have yet to, make sure to subscribe. It's free. It's literally free. And ask anyone that subscribes. They'll tell you. You won't regret it. Trying to hit 294,000 subscribers by the end of the day. That would be sick if we could. Absolutely sick. I don't know why the heck he's still space equaling, by the way. I thought maybe he's going to be farming, but no, he's not. So it's quite interesting that he's still doing that. And also not sending space yellows. Because that would have been a little bit harder for us to defend against, of course. So that's quite interesting. Subscribe for a free cookie. Now, I wish I could say that, but that would be false advertising. Because I don't have cookies. I ain't got no cookies, bro. Vulture Chaz never use meta. Never. It's, it's actually crazy because, like, literally, I never, ever touch meta. Not one time did I ever use meta. I think that's pretty cool. We're going to try this bad boy in last two. We're going to see how it does for us. Gwenny, pop those for me. Pop those. Pop those ice. Oh my god, this ice is so OP, guys. Thank you for putting me on about this. Oh my goodness, it's actually crazy good for early game. Jesus, bro. I was missing out. I'm learning more and more about this strategy every single game and every single day. This is awesome, dude. I'm so hyped. Yeah, but I literally never once did I use the meta. And we made it to the Hall of Masters and we got top 100, baby. Now, I did abuse the dart lane. I don't think I had a choice with that. I kind of just had to. <laughs> so, did do that. But we didn't go strictly meta one time. I never used Dartling, Ninja, Sniper. I never even actually touched the Ninja nor the Sniper. Never even unlocked a single upgrade on either one of those towers either. Even from the XP that you get out of, like, chests and stuff. <laughs> oh, it's round eight. Oh, my God. I'm still sending freaking Space Whites. Oh, I'm throwing the cash. I got to eco hard here, then. Try this strat. Yeah, dude. Okay, so Juicy, I'm going to be coming out with a video tomorrow, definitely, about this strategy once again. And I know a lot more, I feel like, about the strategy. So, two things. One, targeting your sub most of the time to last. You might have to target something a little bit different depending on what map you're on. But targeting the last is so incredibly OP. Like, look at this. Space whites are normally an issue for me. But with this 0-1-3, I'm absolutely chilling absolutely shredding all of these now if i had this on first we would not be chilling and we start we're still at 150 lives so like that is awesome docs is a longer map though um but yeah in order to defend against four to five mobs too on round 18 i normally go for super monkeys i used to go for ballistic missiles but until this update happens ballistic missile is just trash it's just garbage so yeah won't be going for those too often um i'm also gonna go for another sub by the way right just like right there we go with that. I'm still constantly equaling, by the way, with these yellow balloons. What a flex. What a flex, man. Okay, maybe maybe I should maybe I should stop. Because he's still equaling with reds. That leads me 
to believe that he might be aggressive towards us during these mid-game rounds. He hasn't even set down his tower, or his hero, I'm sorry. Like, what's up with that? What's up? What, what's up with that, bro? No, no shot. I feel, I feel it. I feel it. He's got to be rushing me, bro. He has to be. He's got to be rushing me, bro. I mean, I'm going to rush him, dude. He does not defend. Right? At least I don't think. Send some leads. Some of these. And purple's all over the top. He's, oh my god, he's so dead. He is so dead. And that's in fact gonna be... Oh. <laughs> I thought for a second. <laughs> I was like, oh, maybe I should defend it. <laughs> yeah, he only had um, helis. Dude! Wait, did we just make it to uh, CC? We're back in CC, boys? Oh my god, we got so, so much XP right there. We're back in CC. Have we been back in CC? Did I just not notice in the last game? <laughs> That's awesome, dude. Let's go. W's in the chat, boys. We're playing so much better with the strategy, man. This is awesome, dude. All right, so I want to go for Icicle and Pell. Okay, so we're at 18.4K. Got this. If you're new to the stream, welcome. Make sure to drop a like if you have not already. And also, subscribe if you're new. In order to chat, you need to subscribe, so you might as well. And ask anyone that's already subscribed, they'll tell you you won't regret it. We're currently 299 subscribers exactly away from hitting 294,000 subscribers. Let's go. Yee! Let's get it, baby. Uh, maybe this time we could actually go late game. So I'll play on docs again. Can I explain universal XP? So universal XP pretty much means that like extra XP that I have on towers that I already have the masteries unlocked, meaning I have every single upgrade and every like mastery item unlocked for that tower. You can convert that XP to use on other towers. So it's just universal. Or they might have, I don't, they could do that one or two ways. They could do it like that to where like you could convert the XP to universal XP, or they could just have a whole separate thing where you gain universal universal xp after every game as well on top of gaining xp for whatever towers you used or they could just do both at the same time so yeah but yeah universal xp just means you can use that xp on whatever tower you want oh my god bottom path is so much better dude what was i thinking 110 is definitely not the way to go bro holy crap you guys should have been screaming at me. Like, Boltrix, what the heck are you doing, you idiot? I told y'all, bullying works for me, dude. Don't bully, but bullying works for me. So bully me. It sounds like I'm encouraging bullying, but I'm not. Okay? But for me, it's okay. <laughs> We're just roast the heck out of me, bro. Should I go for Gwenny Poo right here? Or Gwenny Poo right here? I always forget where I put her. I like blue hair and blue fire. See, although this guy's going dart lane, like, his dart lane spot is just terrible. So that leads me to believe that, like, he's, like, not that good. No offense to you if you're watching. I'm sorry. But dart lane is just so good that, like, even if he's not that good, it doesn't really matter because he's just going dart lane. And just dart lane is that OP. So that's kind of unfortunate. Place ice slightly higher next time for more range. Ooh, yeah, I see what you're talking about. That, yeah. I just think, like, have it as close as possible because then I can just get up another ice, you know, right above it, but that makes sense, too. We'll go for this right there. I'm already going to start to put this on last. Yes, sir. Yeah, but Embrittlement is goaded. Dude, I'm not going to lie. I've heard that, and like, nah. I haven't seen anything special from Embrittlement, if we're being completely honest. Nice. Nothing special from that. I'm leaking here. Owie. How come last game I didn't leak? Come on, Gwen. Where the heck did your ability go? It did not last at all. 
<laughs> did not last for very long. Like, what the heck? My brother uses meta. Yeah, this is the new meta, bro. My favorite strategy? I don't know. Spike Factory is one of my favorite towers, but, like, I definitely used it a lot. So, like, I have no desire to use the Spike Factory right now. If we're being completely honest. But, yeah. Uh, I'm going to start equally now. How do you feel about them not nerfing Hydro Rocket Pods? That is okay because Hydro Rocket Pods and like, so like a 2-3-0 Dart Lane, for example, in BT6 cannot even handle a few sets of Regen Rainbows. Um, so if that's the case also in BT Battles 2, then I'm okay with that. Yo, what's up, Ryan? How's it going, bro? Dude, you've been popping off, dude. Keep at it, bro. I'm so hyped for you, bro. That's awesome. Oh, I'm going to go for triple here. And also, let's use Gwenny's ability. Mm, I don't want to stop. Eco, we know with the yellow balloons, but I might have to. Actually, do I? Oh, yeah, I do. Mm. <laughs> I definitely should. All right. Dang it. Screw you. Uh, actually, nah. Now I'm gonna go for this reactor. Like, right above this. Yeah. I guess I should've just constantly ecoed there with yellows. It's okay, though. Yeah, I'm kinda playing this bad right now. Yeah, no problem, dude. You're killing it, man. Um... Okay, I'm gonna go for that. Dude, I, I'm always so hyped when, like, other YouTubers do good. Because, like, if you think about it, too, like, if other YouTubers are doing good, that helps the whole community as a whole. You know what I'm saying? It literally does. It brings more views to the entire game, meaning it should help every single YouTuber out. And also, too, I mean, like, you just deserve it. Like, so I'm happy for you at the same time. But, like, it's like a win-win for everybody, you know? I love it. Yes, sir. You might quit BTD Battles too. No, don't quit. New update's gonna come out. I'd give that a chance, man. It's because a lot of things will be fixed. Like, people won't go dartling every game. Like this guy. It's okay, though. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Bye. By the way, the RPM thing, too. That happens. Um... I, I assume that there's more ads around the end of the year due to Christmas. Um, therefore, RPM just like kind of skyrockets because there's just more ads running. Um, and then after Christmas, it just kind of like dips down because like nothing really happens at the beginning of the year. There's like really no holidays or anything like that. Uh, so it's very like normal. Like it happens to everybody. It's unfortunate. All right. But it is what it is. I don't know why I said the word. All right. I just always say all right, dude. If you watch my videos, like. I constantly say that word. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's remove that bad boy. I mean, let's get a let's get a super monkey going up here. Sub ain't gonna help us out against a Moab. Ain't no way. Ain't no way, bro. Oh, he's going for a super as well, but he went for it down here. Now I kinda wanted to go for an ice instead, but maybe this is the play. Now, actually, too, I could do... Mm, I could go like this. Go for an Arctic win here. Then I could set in the water. <laughs> I'm hacking. <laughs> I'm hacking, guys. It's a hack. It's a hack. Not actually. But yeah. If you guys have not already make sure to subscribe also drop a like on the stream okay let's see how we're 270 subscribers away we're gonna hit it tonight boys we're hitting this tonight why are you bringing gwen with loadout and not open since open buff super Ooh, good point so honestly i'm just mainly using gwen because i got tired of using open but that's a really good point i should just use open 
But yeah, like that's honestly the main reason why. Just wanted to switch it up. But that makes a lot more sense for sure. Why the heck did nobody tell me that, bro? I'm blaming y'all. <laughs> Get snowstorm on the water with range. Yeah, see, I can just do this. It's more range, so I can like set like all the way down here. Look at that. <laughs> Too OP, bro. I wanted to go for icicle impale, so like that's why I kind of wanted to save this spot right here. Now, is it the way to go? Probably not, but it's okay. Or actually, I can't even go for that. I can go for icicles though. Frozen balloons grow sharp. Icicles that can pop balloons that touch them. Sick. Kind of just want to try it out. Let's see how it goes for us. Uh, let's see how it can do against this Moab. Ooh. It shredded those ceramic balloons. We'll take that. You always say trust the process and no shot literally all the time. I know. I really do. Got you. Makes sense. Yeah, so eventually, like, say, like, this, like, strategy becomes, like, meta and I use it for, like, Hall of Masters Grand or something. Really? Were the purples really necessary? Were they? Wow. That was rude. He's still equal with purples. Get out of here, bro. He's spending so much money doing that. But yeah, like, say this is meta. Like, for Hall of Masters push, like, definitely just gonna use, like, whatever is the best. So, yeah. Yo, what's up, no monies? How's it going, bro? We got some epic late game going on. Now, we can't go past round 40 because they leaked because I'm bad. But that is okay. We're getting better every game. I literally... I think I was at, like, 43 trophies. And now I'm at, like, 52. So, like, bro. Out here. Winning left and right. Ooh, okay. All right. So, I kind of want to go for Dark Knights instead of first striking this. Because, like, honestly, first strikes are terrible. They're not good, bro. And then, like, when you have to micro it, first of all, it's a cooldown on an ability. Second of all, I lose so much money when I micro it, bro. I don't think it's the way to go. I don't think it's the way to go, boys. Let's see, though, how well we can defend against this. I do have Snowstorm, so I can use that. I kind of want to use that when I pop it down to Moabs. By the way, this sub's going to do absolutely nothing to this. Just thought I'd let y'all know that. Um, So I probably should actually upgrade this one up here to a Dark Knight. Maybe I should not be ecoing here. All right, got that. Sick. Should I tower boost this? Icicles do something? Maybe? No? They're like, no, we don't want to do anything. All right, I'm going to stop vehicling for a second. Uh, use that. Actually. Wow. Okay. Good thing that we did not tower boost. We definitely did not need to. Let's freaking go. That was actually really good. It was awesome. Yeah, so first striking that, like, honestly, dude, guys, sub is, like, kind of just, like, until it gets freaking nerfed, or buffed, I'm sorry. <laughs> it needs a hard buff. Um, it's just kind of, like, there for mid-game purposes to decamo. Reactor's all right. It's not that good, though. They should have just not touched it. They nerfed it after the first um, update. Um, and then they're going to buff Ballistic, so that will be nice. Defend it well, yeah. So that's the way to go. I normally would try to defend against... Uh, things like that, like fortified ZOMGs, um, BFBs, and fortified mobs even. With sub, that's not the way to go right now. Sub is just not good enough. But with a new update, it's going to make it like eight times stronger. Ballistic missile against like ceramic mod class balloons, I think. So that that would like, against a fortified mob, sub would be the way to go. But even a fortified ZOMG, I don't know. Maybe, maybe Super Monkey would still be the way to go. Who knows? Should I stop echoing or I guess. Yeah. Cause I probably want to send him a rush, right? Probably get more supers up here too. And then I 
could go for another super storm right here if I wanted to. Is this the wave? And then I can go for more super monkeys down here so they can hit both paths. He's still equaling, by the way. I'm going to have to punish him for that, correct? That is, like, such a hard amount of eco, bro. What happens if you place a Superstorm in the water, then sell the Superstorm? So, if I sell... Okay, that's a really good question. If I sell this right now, this will auto-sell all of these here. That's a really good question. Because these are in water. So, without the Superstorm... Or Snowstorm, I'm sorry. It just can't stay there, so it would just auto-sell those. No shot he defends this, right? Did he go for MAD? Even the... But MAD all the way back there, bro? No. No shot he defends this. Even if he goes for that. But he was fully ecoing there, too. Spending all that money. I don't think that was the way to go. I don't, I don't think that was the way to go, boys. Yeah, he's barely even popping it now. I'm going to keep my current defenses in case he wants to counter with DDTs. I can't even tell how well he's defending against this, though. Like, I'm not used to this balloon skin. I guess we'll see here in a second. Looks like he's popping it down, though. But only three Dark Knights up there? Like, there, no shot this can defend, right? I can't even send another one, really. I don't want to send DDTs. I think DDTs are too easy of a defend. Now, once once he's turned his EOMGs and stuff, he might be screwed. Because only four Dark Knights, I don't think they can handle multiple fortified ZOMGs. He has one more tower boost, by the way. He's going to sell. This is why I kept my defenses, guys. Just to be safe. He's going to sell to replace up there. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to send another VAD just to get in the way of this Rocket Storm. <laughs> Definitely did not need to do this. But it's okay. He's got a counter. He's not defending that. Doesn't matter. Yep, that's a GG. Ooh, possibly. Yep. GG's. Let's go, baby. I kind of wanted him to rush me, but, like, he just refused. He can't counter. That's the thing. And he was full-on ecoing that entire time. So, like, obviously, I sent BOD first. But, like, yeah. DDTs he can't counter with, so. I don't think, at least. I think we would actually shred those, if I'm not mistaken. The ceram like once you pop off the DDT, ceramics are actually pretty tough to defend against, but we did have um two middle path ices, so that helped us out, you know? That would have helped us out with like stalling those ceramic balloons. Okay, so we need 10,000 more XP. Let's go. If you guys are new to the stream, welcome. Make sure to click that subscribe button, boys. All right, we're getting good with the strategy, man. We're getting real good with this strategy. Let's go, dude. I'm so hyped. I was taking L's left and right. But, like, I'm finally learning a lot more about this strategy, bro. Oh, dude, we're 250 subscribers away, too, by the way. From hitting 294 subscribers. I keep on saying 294. 294,000. <laughs> Let's go. I'm feeling good, bro. I was getting clowned yesterday for streaming, too. I'm not going to lie. Like, people were clowning on me because, like, I was just playing super poorly. But, like, I don't know. I just didn't know how to use these towers. But, like... I still probably don't, but I'm getting a lot better for sure. So somebody said to set the ice a little bit further away. So I'm going to try to do that. See if that works out. Because ice position on this map doesn't really matter. Like this ice in the long run is not going to do that much for us, you know. Go for refreeze as well. He's going dart lane. That's okay. What's up, Marco? How's it going, bro? Embrittlement is good against ceramics. Now, I have used Embrittlement multiple times. And it has, like, I have not seen anything, like, really, like, significant about it. Like, that, I was going to go su for uh, Super Brittle first, which is top half hit through upgrade. But then people were like, eh, it's like, meh. People were saying that Icicle Impale is probably my best bet. So, I'm going to go with that. When does the update come out? Hopefully within the next few weeks. There's no confirmed date. But NK finally got back from holiday, their vacation. That was well-deserved. Um, I should have went for Gwendolyn, by the way, a long time ago, but it's okay. So, yeah. Finally back at it in the office. So hopefully it's sometime very, very, very soon. Crosspath is better on embrittlement. 
I think middle path because deep freeze and stuff. Freezes through two layers of balloons and freezes for even longer. I could be wrong though. I'm not an expert when it comes to that. <laughs> yeah, dude, you did. Were you the one that's telling me? A ton of people were telling me, yeah, like, dude, bottom path is better. No cap, no cap. As long as I know it now, you know? As long as I know it now. Best non-metal tower is Engineer. Yeah. Engineer is really good. And the fits here, bottom path, triple XL trap. Oh my god. It's insane. Defense infinite DDTs. You get so much money with it, so you can rush with multiple fortified BABs round 30. It's crazy, crazy good. Oh no. I'm gonna leak. That's okay. No, no, no. Alright, maybe our sub spot is not that good. Or I need triple guns in our soul barb. So yeah, I'm gonna go for triple here in a sec. Alright, there we go. And I'm gonna go for barbed here in a sec. Perfect. It doesn't help that this thing's in the way too, but it's okay. Alright, so we did take a punch, but the good thing is, like, obviously we're not going past round 40, so it's okay that we could tank lives. Especially on these shorter maps. Alright, let's get to it! Dun, 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 dun. Can you repeat the updates that are coming? There's a whole list of the entire patch notes in my bio. Or not in my bio, in the description. <laughs> you can check them out. It's posted on the BTD Battles 2 Reddit. But yeah, there's a link in the description, first link. Send yellows, yeah. Yellows are hard, but when you have dart lane, nothing's hard. I cannot believe you just tower boosted that, though. That was, like, weird timing, because we were just talking about, like... You just said how hard they are, and he ended up tower boosting. He did not need to. He wasn't even close to leaking. See, like, a guy like this, why are you using... Ali, Ali, why are you using Dartling? You literally have the sauces looking things, shooting out your Dartling gunner, meaning you have the mastery unlocked, meaning you have every freaking Fitzer upgrade unlocked for it. Why the heck are you using it? What? What is that? <laughs> TikToker confirmed. I forget what I said. Alright, so now we do not need this on last. At least I don't think. Taxers? Yeah, Taxers are still good. Mm -hmm. They just kind of fall off a little bit more late game now. But, I mean, with Maelstrom ability, you can defend against any make game rush that's not camo unless you have village or sub 2D camo. So, yeah. Sub is, I mean, tag is a really good option still. Yeah, cryo cannon. Yeah. I don't think I need to go for it this game, though. Because I don't think it's going to help us all, all that much. So, um, I can't actually eco that hard here. Like, I can. But I've got to be aware of round 18 fortified maps. Those are hard to defend against, bro. On a map like this. It's just too short. Heli meta. Ooh, look at these freaking lead balloons, bro. Gwenny Gwen, going for me. Thank you, babe. I don't know why I said that. <laughs> that was so cringe. <laughs> what am I saying, bro? Dude, are you kidding me? How the heck? Should I go for middle path then? Or should I just like, like is it too late? All right, we're fine. Let's go. All right, so I'm going to go for super here. I'm going to remove this here. I'm going to start ecoing the greens so I can save up a little bit more cash. I'm going to go for knockback and laser blast at least. Clip it. Exposed, bro. I'm exposed. Don't expose me. Come on, dude. Come on. He's also going super. Interestante! He's also not ecoing at all right now. That kind of scares me. Why aren't you ecoing, my friend? Get back to ecoing. 
Now, how well does this do against multiple fortified? I don't know. Probably not that well, to be honest with you. <laughs> Probably not that well at all. I have to mainly rely off super here. All right, so I think we're fine against that. At least I hope. Right? Come on, bro. Come on. Are you kidding me? Against a normal Moab? Oh my god, that was so terrible. What the heck? Wow. We didn't catch a loss for a long time, but to just lose to a regular normal Moab. Like, oh my god, it's so terrible. I don't want to, like, I could have upgraded my sub there, but I don't want to put money into the sub because the sub is just so bad. It's so bad against Moabs. I'll play on Glade again, though. I want to learn Glade better. Subs are cheeks. Yeah, bro. Like, I, <laughs> that's why I literally, like, the armor pierce upgrade, it does better against my class balloons, but, like, I literally don't think it's worth $3,000. That's why I did not want to put $3,000 into one upgrade that's terrible. Boys, we are 223 subscribers away, all right? So if you are new, make sure to subscribe. We were on like a nine win streak right there, all right? That was a really bad game. I, I, I'm blaming my towers, okay? Like, that's not my fault. No, that's not my fault. That was my towers' fault, bro. They weren't trying hard enough. What was that? Like, what? That was terrible. That was terrible, bro. I had a 101 freaking super monkey and it couldn't defend against a normal Moab. You're joking, bro. You're joking, bro. You're joking. Let's go for Gwenny Poo. Gwenny, come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We get it. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. Why are you saying, hmm? Lord, what did I do? Where do I live? You want my exact address? I can give it to you. Up. Try out striker, bomb, ice, and village. I'm gonna stick with this try. Uh, uh, uh. You know what's funny? Like, there's like a lot of people out there that say sub ice combo is good, and I think it can be. It's just sub is so terrible right now. It's actually so terrible. What towers should you push for? Um, Super Monkey is still a solid tower, so if you haven't used that, I would use that. Um, I don't know. Ice. People were saying ice is going to be good. Sub is getting a huge buff. Boat's getting buffed. Farm's getting buffed. Druids, I think, are getting buffed. There's a lot of different options. I could not tell you, though. I don't know what the heck the meta is going to be. Please. I'm leaking for sure. I just was not ready. Well, hopefully after we get barred, we'll be good. <laughs> so did I stop hitting late game? Okay, so... Yeah, a lot of people are confused on why that was my name. I think I got a, like a lot of new viewers. Um, but I made a proposition to my viewers because I didn't do something. I forget what it was. Um, but I was like, because I didn't do this, I will let you guys pick whatever you want my name to be, my next name. And since I went late game a lot in BTB Battles 1, people were like, how about you just make your name I Hate Late Game since you love going late game? 
Which, I mean, like, I like late game. It's not like I'm a huge, huge late game fan, but, like, it, it was fun in Battles 1 to just, like, meme and troll with, like, late game strategies, which I was, like, doing a lot more towards the end of BTD Battles 1 for me on the channel. I mean, not saying, like, I'll never play it again. I'm just saying, like, you know, within the past year, like, turn more into a late gamer, I guess. Um, so, yeah, they just said, make your name to I hate late games, so I just didn't change it. But, like, now I was like, eh, probably should just change it to just regular old bull tricks. So, yeah. I skipped leg day. Ha ha ha! Don't make me do this. Don't don't make me do this to you. Cause I gladly will. Come on, give, give me a second. Give me a second. Give me a second. Oh my god, he might rush me here. By the way, I'm scared. He's really got no camera detection, by the way, boys. Just saying. Okay, he forwarded it. Fair play. He has camera detection now. <laughs> well done. Let's try these out. Really sending me ceramics. Are you fine against that? How well he? Is he dead? GG's. All right. Sorry. Um. Wow. I was like really focused on that game. Um, a lot was happening. So, you are funny out there, whoever said that. You're, you're, you're a funny guy. You know that? You're a real funny guy. Now, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to do a little bit of flexing. I'm sorry. He made me do it, bro. Yep. You, you made me do it. You, you you think I skip leg day? Leg day's every day for me. Don't you ever say that. Ever. I rest my case. I rest my case. My case is rested. <laughs> is Jury good? Yeah. From what I've heard. And it's going to receive buffs, so. Why are my ankles so small? Bro, I know. I Okay, I can't lie. I do be skipping ankle day, though. Okay? I do be skipping that, though. Yeah, dude, I, I constantly, Parker, Parker, I constantly have that photo up and I just like stare at it. I'm like, wow, look at that. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm joking. I'm, I'm, I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> oh, it sounds like I'm like a total douche, dude. I'm so sorry, guys. It was all for jokes. <laughs> all right, he's going ninja as a starting tower. That is quite, quite the sight. We don't want to do that. Should go for refreeze though. Drink water. True. Let me drink some water. I got some right here. I haven't really been drinking water that much. 
<laughs> All right. Now it's over. It's over for this dude. We've mastered this strategy. It's over for you. It's over. You stand no chance now. All right, now my ego's through the roof, bro. Oh my god. Someone gotta stop me, bro. Someone gotta put me in my place. This guy's gotta destroy me. All right, let's go for subby. Subby sub. Put that boy on last. Why'd you name yourself Voltrix? I just randomly thought of the name because, like, I like... I like electric. Okay. Now, when I say electric, I should say, like, electric-type Pokemon, for example. I should have... Oh, yeah, I need to remember to put it a little bit away from the track. It works a little bit better like that. Uh, but, yeah, electric-type Pokemon. And then I was, like, thinking, like, Bolt. And I was like, Boltrix. Yeah. And then that was my Minecraft name. And then I was like, oh, I should make this also my YouTube name. So, yeah, that's why I did that. But my original Minecraft name was Slenderman's underscore dad. Because I like Slenderman, because I like horror stuff, because horror is amazing. But, ended up changing that. By the way, I was in a Technoblade video. Reflex, but I, I indeed was. I was in a Technoblade video. I have been subscribed uh, to Technoblade, by the way, for a very, very, very long time. We leaked that. We leaked that. Gwenny Gwen, come on. You had to go in a little bit harder for me. I wanted to go for triple guns first, that's why. Alright, there we go. And then barbed after, and then we should be chilling, I think. Ow, this hurts! Stop it! Alright, now we're chilling. <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go. What's up, Marco? What gym did I go to? Um, can't say that. Sorry. It's a local gym. I don't go to the gym, dude. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah. Technoblade's an awesome guy, dude. He's like a very like unique YouTuber for sure. Oh, he's tower boosting that. Uh oh. Seventy-four. That just reminded me of that clip. So I'm gonna play like kind of like safer against this guy, cause like since he's starting out with Ninja, like. He's got to be, like, kind of trolling, you know? Ninja can't defend mid-game. As much as... As I want to say it's broken, it's just not good early or mid. So... Yeah. Do you like Dragon Ball Z? Oh, do I like Dragon Ball Z? Ha! <sighs> Why, have you seen my... Have you seen my figurines back here? Oh my god, my hair looks like terrible. I'm so sorry, dude. I haven't even looked at this. Uh, wait. Give me a second. <gasps> oh, no! I'm sitting blacks. No. Whoa, what happened? Alright, we're back. No shot you're ecoing this hard when you're going ninja. What? Just in case if he wants to rush me, I'm just gonna get that up. So we're chillin'. I mean, clearly he can't defend mid-game. He's got to have tax here then, possibly. And he's, like, trying to incline me to rush him. At least I think. Because he is equaling. This boy is equaling hard. By the way, yeah. I'm just going to send him some lead balloons here. Because he has, like, no lead detection. Some rainbows and then purples all up the top. We'll see how he likes that. I mean, it's 100% dead at that. Oh, I was going to try to spam ices real quick. GG's. But yeah, dude, look. Look at this. I just got this one for Christmas. Oh, shoot. Oh, okay, that fell. It's Broly, dude. Look at that. Isn't that sick? Sheesh. Dude, I got, I got so many other ones, too. Like, I got Frieza here, first form. Cool. Goku Black. And Super Santa Rose. Dude, you already know. We got everybody, bro. I got cell up here too. I got I got more. I got a cell right here. Alright, let's let's get out of there. GG's. 54 trophies. Alright, we made a comeback, boys. We made a comeback with this strategy.
I'm so hyped about that, man. Get your spike factory XP out of here. And also sniper. Oh, I finally... Look, look. Just to prove it to y'all. Look, sniper. I can finally unlock an upgrade. Never have I ever unlocked anything for the sniper. Ha! That's hilarious. Finally, though, I did. I just didn't have enough XP. Nor for the ninja. See, I just don't get XP for this tower, I guess. The game knew it was broken, so it was like we refused to give you XP out of chest for these two towers. That's what I have to guess. Um, but yeah. The, the Broly dope. Thank you, thank you. Man. Let's do it. Yeah. Um, I also have this one here. Let me show you. I like this one a lot. Vegeta. And um, his Royal Super Saiyan Blue form. Oops, that fell. That's cool. I also have Goku in his Ultra Instinct form. Uh, let's get it. Uh, since he's not ready up, I can show you another one. I have Bardock here. Now, he always falls over, bro. That's the only annoying thing about him. But I also I have a different head for him. I have his like normal form. Am I a nerd? Figurines go crazy. Thank you. I hope. I hope you answer yes to the, to the nerd question. I love being a Dragon Ball nerd. I don't care. I think being a nerd is a great thing. You just hit 50 tropes today? Nice, bro. Yeah. Dragon Ball is top tier, bro. You like Bardock? Hey, that's what's up. Alright, so yeah, I'm gonna set this like... Oh my god, bro. If we like set like ice like right here, would it be like super OP? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> That's sick. Let's go. Key lines for balloons. It's the middle keys. So A through semicolon. Because there's what? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. And then A S D F G H J K L yeah semicolon. Yep. Grew up on DBZ, such a good time watching it with brothers. Oh for sure, dude. With the Bruce Falconer music too. Like if you watched it in the United States, oh my god. Like that music is just like so like nostalgic to me, bro. Like it's just so good. Skip cheat day. It's always good to have a cheat day here and there to keep you sane, you know? Do I like One Piece? I've never watched it, but I've heard great things about it. I've heard really good things about One Piece. I've heard a really good things about a lot of animes. I've only watched Attack on Titan, which was only a little bit too. Um, Death Note and then Dragon Ball. That's, those are the only animes I've watched. I want to watch more. It's just like... I don't know. It's just hard to get into, I guess. It's a commit, you know? By the way, I'm going to put this bad boy on last. Go for air bursties. And uh, we're going to leak. Unless we use Gwenny. Oh, we're still going to leak. You little... You little sucker, you. Don't cry at me. Using Dartling. Get out of here. Sorry. Yeah, you should be sorry. You just wait. Yeah, I don't I don't know. Maybe I should have went for Bard first. Because I'm tanking lies out here. We are struggling. So maybe next time I'll go for Bard. And then I'll go for this triple gun. Because I ended up leaking down to 63. This is like kind of like the lowest amount we've been at in a while. Which is good. Because like, normally this would be like an every game thing. I'm so funny. I'm really not, though. Oh, come on. I'm on last, right? Bro. Try harder, dude. Oh, I, I was hoping he would leak. Clearly, he's not going to leak. He's going freaking Dartling, dude. Is sub good? I'm going to be completely honest with you. No, it's not. Hopefully, it's a little bit better after this update, though, because they plan on buffing it. Dude, I am struggling. Come on. 
This sub is terrible. What the heck is it doing, bro? That's my favorite tower spike factory. Jesus. Uh, come on, sub. Do a little bit better for me. Look at that. You just leaked a yellow. For what? For what, though? Sending us live balloons. Now that's just... Oh, I never went for refreeze. Is that why I'm struggling out here? Oh, no. Was that why I was struggling, guys? No shot, right? Dude, get out of here. Camel leads, dude? What? Or just regular leads? Said sub is still is terrible. Yeah. It is. Do I play DB Legends? I do not. I tried to get into it, but it just wasn't my thing. But I played Dragon Ball Kakarot. Or Dragon Ball Z Kakarot, sorry. That is like my favorite Dragon Ball game. That open world is so good. DLCs are really good too. Well Trunks one the Trunks one was. Yeah, says so as Vaz uses it. The thing is, dude, I like I know what's good in this game. Dartling. I'm not using Darlene, bro. I'm sorry. I, I'm just not using that. I used it all season one. I'm so tired of it. I don't want to use that anymore. But yeah, sub sub is definitely a mid-tier tower. I won't even lie. But with this next update, they plan on buffing it. So I'm hopeful that it will be a lot better than what currently is. Because it is trash right now. I'm not even trying to complain when I say that too. Like It's just, it's just terrible. It really is. <laughs> like, I get up a ballistic missile and it can't even defend a regular Moab. Like, what? That's so bad. What be doing? What be doing? Darlene is boring. Like, I understood why people use Darlene in the first season and Hall of Masters for sure, too. They wanted to get top 100, top 10, whatever, like they were aiming for. You know, I, I, I get it. I get it. Oh my god, we're so dead. Yeah, we're so dead. I have nowhere near enough money to go for anything. Wow, dude. I'm so dead. GG's. Dang, bro. Ah! Round 17 mods are really struggle to. I've noticed that. That is okay. GG's, GG's. We really struggled around 17 mobs, like a lot. I gotta find out a better way to defend against those. But yeah, so like with this new update, Monkey Sub, it's gonna decrease the cost. It takes the upgraded air burst starts from 1,000 to 800. Triple guns from 1,100 to 950. Armor piercing arts from 3,000 to 2,800. Ballistic missile damage from 1 to 2 for balloons. And then from 6 to 8 for ceramics. And then preemptive strike ballistic missile damage from 1 to 10. And then ceramics plus 15 damage. And the abilities, which is the first strike ability, will be available immediately. That's a lot of freaking buffs for it, bro. Because right now, it's terrible. It does no damage to Moab class balloons. Now, if we had this sub right here for this next update, I could upgrade to a ballistic missile in like bottom path sub, and I could actually defend against round 17 mobs that way. But instead, I have to try to use super, and super is just too expensive that early on to defend against those mobs. You see what I'm saying? The cell hockey is backspace. My DB Legends name? I have no idea. I've not, like, I, I, I touched it, like, only a few times. I don't play it, really. Um... Uh... No, 
know. You get no heart because you're using Dart Link. I guess you can get a heart. Ever played mobile? I used to on BTD Battles 1, but no, I don't with this game. Because PC definitely has a huge advantage over mobile users. By the way, boys, if you are new to the stream, welcome, first of all. We're only 169 subscribers away from hitting 294,000 subscribers. So make sure, if you have not already, to click that subscribe button. All right, I'm going to go for refreeze because last time I forgot to do that. Uh, so, yeah. Also going to go for a Gwenny. Here we go. So sick and tired of seeing Dartling. Yeah. It's only a matter of time before they update it. Make Laser Shock terrible. And hopefully the Dartling is just terrible and it just goes away for a while. Because <laughs> I'm so tired of seeing it as well. Yeah. Should I put it more in the middle? For sure. I mean, it still affects these up here. So I guess we're chilling. But yeah. Next time I'll go for middle. Alrighty. But yeah, also too, if you have yet to drop a like on the stream as well. Thank you guys for coming out. Appreciate it. Two Dartlings. Dartlings are so P. They're so balanced, dude. I love it. <laughs> I don't think Dartling's that good, bro. I think Dartling needs a buff. Who agrees? I think Dartling needs a buff. A hard buff too. Like when I say hard, I mean a hard, hard buff, bro. Defend the red! Defend the red! Defend the red! You little... Like, see how much I struggle to space whites? I mean, granted, I am using ice, but, like, look at how much I struggle. And then look at this dude. <laughs> I mean, come on. That is actually terrible. That is t -t 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 terrible. Ugh, thought I heard some new restrictions for arenas and such BS. It's just to help newer players coming into the game. Like imagine in a year from now, because this is something I talked about in my video. Like imagine in a year from now, like a new player starts playing this game. A lot of people are gonna have a ton of upgrades. So if they go against an experienced player, they're just not even gonna be able to compete with them because they just don't have on par upgrades. So limiting like tier fours and tier threes based on whatever arena you're in is a good idea, I think. Because if you have those good upgrades, eventually like, and, and if you've been playing the game for a year, I think you should be like in at least like Moat Pit or something. Which there will be no limits in that. I think it's like limits in Yellow Stadium, White Wasteland, and then Lead Dungeon. And then CC and up is fine. You can use all upgrades. All right, so yeah, this time with the um, with the sub, we defended way better. We leaked down like to like 63 lives, I think, last time. This time we did way, way better. So that's good. They're going to buff MAD. Yeah. I don't know how to feel about that, but it is what it is. That's definitely the best fits here then on the dart lane. They're also buffing the Ray of Doom. Decreasing the cost. It takes the upgrade from 95k to 80. So what happened to a Lucian? Nothing. He's just busy with college and stuff. He'll get back into the grind. Trust. But yeah, now we're only 155 subscribers away. So, once again, if you guys are new, welcome to the stream. My name is Boltrix. We do BTD Battles 2 content here, obviously. So, make sure, if you are new, to subscribe. You have to subscribe, too, in order to talk in the chat, first of all. And ask anyone that's already subscribed to tell you you won't regret it. Also, drop a like on the stream, too. I guess we're trying to hit like 1,500 likes on the stream, all right? We're currently at 1,356, meaning that we're 144 or 144 likes away from hitting 1,500. So they're both free, so you might as well do it. It'd be greatly appreciated from your boy. All right, so this time, that's our biggest week. Our biggest weekend. Our biggest weakness now. <laughs> Come on, Boltrick, spit it out, bro. How are we not defending those leads? What? I know we don't have middle path here, but like I thought Gwenny Gwen could save us. Put this to strong in them. But our biggest weakness now is Moabs on round 17. Literally. 
I don't know how else we're going to defend against these. Super Monkey is just too expensive. I'm going to try Sub again. We'll, we'll see. Going for an Armor Piercing because Armor Piercing is supposed to give us additional damage to Moab Class Balloons. Okay? Therefore, it should be good against Moabs on round 17. So we will see if it is in fact. And then maybe we can go for Cryo Cannon because this is apparently good against Ceramics. But looks like right now he's still equaling, so that's a good sign. So if he doesn't send us a Moab, then I guess we just don't have to upgrade in the first place, which will be super nice. What arena am I at? I'm in Ceramic Crucible right now, and I have 54 trophies, I think. Something like that. At least this guy's going Spike Factory. I respect that. By the way, I'm going to put this back on two first. Sub is crap. Yeah, it's a, such a mid-tier tower, bro. It's not good. I agree. Then people are like, why is he using it then? Because it's going to be good, all right? I don't want to use meta, too. I'm not trying to use meta every game. Already did that last season. Been there, done that. Not doing it. Not doing it. Nope. All right, so he just, like, never sent us anything. Now, since we have $10,000 worth of money saved up, we could just go for a super instead. I think, at least, right? Oh, my God. Tell me that defends, right? Tell me that defends, right? Tell me that defends, right? Jeez. Oh my goodness, dude. Okay, maybe we should have went for some subs. Oh, of course. He's going ninja, though. Great. Love to see that. Sorry. Yeah, you should be sorry. You should be. I know exactly what I'm going to do against this guy, though. Yeah, use your sticky bombs while you can, man. Because guess what? In the next update... It's going bye-bye. Ha <laughs> ha. It's going bye-bye, bruh. No more stacking of the sticky bombs. Yep, just like that. Just like that. Pew. Boom. Just like that. Two zero threes. So I go for middle path because uh, early game, um, this is better. 100,000 million percent. You cannot tell me otherwise. Barb darts is 1,000 percent better. For space lights around five. So that is why I have this. So I guess I could theoretically eventually sell this off. Uh, so yeah. Of course, give your little freaking Sabo, you little cheater. You little cheater using the freaking ninja. You little cheating. Cheater, 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 cheater. He's not a cheater. Yeah, get more spike factories. Go ahead. Abuse him. Abuse him. He's got the micro spike storm. That's not the way to go. Use your sabo too. He's going to have to micro the crap out of that. Oh my god, sabo is so good. Do you see how slow it is now? What? The? What? What? I already popped that down. What? Tell me that's death, right? Tell me that's death, right? Oh, that's so death. Yeah. Whew. Thank the Lord. <laughs> that's the one thing that the, the Spike Factory struggles to. Is those ceramic balloons, they can get a little bit tough. GG's. Yeah, we're at 54 trophies, all right? So we've got some dumb losses, too. I guess defending round 17 mobs, I'm going to have to go for a sub. Super Monkey is just too expensive. And then round 18, 45 mobs? Yikes. I'm just, like, screwed. <laughs> all right, so we have 23,500 XP. We need. I'm going to go for Icicle Impale. That means we need 6,500, all right? So that's pretty good. Let's check our uh, Super Monkey. Ooh, we got 30,000 XP. Sheesh. What, what do you guys think I should go for? All right, so 
put in chat one for sun temple two for tech terror three for dark champion i heard dark champion is terrible because it's 60k and you're just better off spamming dark knights um but let me know what you guys think one two or three Ooh, twos got some twos in there mainly twos i think two tech terror is really cheap too so i could go for that by the way i don't think sub ice is the move on this map so i'm just gonna skip that oh we have not gone this map in a long time let's do it disintegrates ddt's correct i use normally dark knight though for ddt's but ooh -hoo. We can do it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's get it, baby. All right. By the way, now we're only 117 subscribers away from 294,000. If you are new, make sure to click that subscribe button. Right. I think I'm going to go with two, guys. A lot of people have been stating two, so I'm going to end up doing that. So I'm going to go for the ice, by the way, like right there. Go for this. Perfect. Perfecto. Then we'll go for Gwenny Poo right there. When's a new update include? So the update is in my description. First link. If you want to go check out the patch notes. Because there's just too much to say about that. So yeah. I'm going to put her to strong. So she can pop down those green balloons for us so we don't leak to them. Tease the green and black balloon. That's a ZOMG. Good question. DDTs are the the all the black one. It's like entirely black and like gray. So I'm gonna go for a sub actually like over here. Like right there. Adam Ross, what's up? Still waiting, man. Yeah. Did I, did I did I clickbait in the title? Be honest, guys. Because I put new balloon CD battles two update coming soon, though. Like, could you not see the coming soon part? Because a lot of people have been asking that question. Yeah, it's not out just yet. Maybe a good sub target targeting up here. Like if I got a sub right here and then set it to last, maybe that would be good. Luckily for us, he's not even sending us space white, so that's much appreciated. Oh, I spoke too soon. All right. On round 11, try a regen zebra rush. And in round 18, try regen rainbow. It depends on what towers he has. So with like this boomer, he's going to be fine. Especially if he gets more glaze by then, which he probably will have. More glaze pretty much defends every like, like balloon, non moab class balloon, except for ceramics. Ceramics is the one thing it will struggle to, but besides that, it's really, really good. Oh, I should be constantly equaling by the way with yellow balloons. Oopsies. I'm gonna go for like sub like right. Wow, we can set this really far left. Just eco a little bit harder. All right, now we're gonna start space equaling. Saving up money for this reactor upgrade. Weren't you supposed to play with Oven so your super monkeys are stronger? Yeah. Yeah. 
it would be the better hero. I just always used to use Oban, so like that's kind of why I'm using Gwendolyn now. Just to switch it up. But yeah, honestly, like besides even buffing that, like like obviously Oban buffs uh, magic towers, but even if it didn't do that, Oban's still by far the best hero, so yeah. All right, let's get it. He's already got camera detection on that village. So Boomer Village. Last tower is probably Super Monkey, Spike Factory, something like that. Probably Super. With this strat, what do you do against camos other than Super Monkey? Good question. So with camos, we don't really have to worry about camos because we have sub. If we go for reactor, that actually decamos all camo balloons for us. Um, so yeah, we don't have to worry about camos. Can't pop lead balloons though. This is still set to strong. I guess I'm just gonna keep her on strong. I think someone told me to do that as well a long time ago, and it's been working out pretty well so far, so we'll just do that. Keep her on strong. So to defend against a round 17 mob, I think I'm gonna go for armor pierce darts. And uh yeah, hopefully that's gonna work. And then I could also go for another sub right here, ballistic missile one. So yeah, but I'm gonna end up going for top path so that we have maximum range on that. Now he'll struggle as well, but all he has to do is just upgrade to a mob press and then he's fine. What do you grind? I say grind ice and super. I heard ice is gonna be good. Super is like just a solid late game tower. I would not grind. I'll tell you what not to grind. Ninja, dart lane, sniper, spike factory. I would not grind those. Village if you have yet to grind. Village is solid. And now Homeland, you can use immediately, which is like, eh. I mean, it's good that you can. I, I wasn't worried before, though. I would always have Homeland up anyway, just so I could use it. Because there used to be like a five-second cooldown, I think. But now you can just use the ability immediately. Same thing with the sub as well, which will help with my Korean. I don't know why they ever added a cooldown on any ability. That doesn't make sense to me, but yeah. I guess we just don't have to worry about that anymore anyway. So, round 17, never sent us a regular Moab. Quite interesting. I'm going to send him one Fortify, just to force that upgrade on his side, because now he's equal with Pinks, too. So, that will force that Moab press upgrade on his side. Oh, wow. And a Tower Boost? I mean, I'll take that. Yep, and there's that Moab press. He's absolutely fine against that. My price is a different breed, bro. Look at this. Did you see how good that was? Wow, why? Dude, his my price just screwed him over. What? I would be so mad if I were him. I don't know what the heck happened right there. His Moab press just did not work, dude. His Moab press was like, eh, eh I'm not trying. Mm -mm. Wow. That's crazy. That's crazy, man. Wait, where's my... Okay. Ooh, wait. On what tower? Druid. Oh, I can go for Druid start? Eh, why not? I got all tier threes on that now. Sick. I don't even use Super Monkey. Shoot. How much XP are we? 5,000. All right. Maybe we won't. We, we might not get today. But 55 trophies. Let's go, guys. Oh, Santa's time. Let's get it. All right, boys. So we're 103 subscribers away. Exactly. I just checked. So if you're new to the stream, make sure to subscribe. We're trying to hit 294 to... 294,000 subscribers by the end of the stream. I think we can do it. We're definitely going to do it by the end of the day, though. That's that's awesome. But yeah, also, too, drop a like. We hit 1,500 likes. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Why should I grind ice? Apparently, ice is going to be good in the next update. So, yeah. On a six-win treat with this strat. Let's go, Alex. Yes. That's awesome to hear, bro. Yeah, I think I just needed to um, 
get used to the strategy, learn it. Because I was really not doing well right at the beginning. I was like struggling with it. I died so many times to space whites, dude. But yeah, like that doesn't happen anymore, which is awesome. A bold opinion on Spike Storm nerf. It's going to kill Spike Factor, unfortunately, late game. That means, so like with the Spike Storm nerf, that means tower boost. Um, any abilities on it, so like Homeland, anything like that, that buffs its attack speed, won't work. That's so stupid. That's so dumb, bro. That kills Spike Factory. I don't know why the heck they would do that. Maybe that's the only way they can nerf it. I don't know. So yeah, it sucks. It really does. But time to find a new meta, I guess, right? <laughs> How much mastery do I have? I have mastery for sub, boomer, spike factory, village. Um, There's got to be another tower in there. I just can't think of it right now. There definitely is another tower in there. What am I? Dartling. Duh. Uh, I think that's actually it. I think there was... So sub, dartling, boomer... <laughs> <laughs> Why am I blanking right now? I literally just said him. Sub, Dartling, Boomer, Spike Factory, Village. Yeah, those are the ones. Tack, tack, tack. Yes, tack, tack. Tack as well. So I have six towers out of what? 22, I think. What the heck, bro? What the heck is going on? Yeah, so six. That's pretty good. I'm happy with that. Oh, finally, bro. Jeez, Louise. 82 subscribers away, boys. Can we hit it by the end of this game? He's saying, wow. Yeah, that did take some time, bro. All right, so I'm going to go for like ice. Like, oh, he's going ice too. Let's go, baby. Oh, no shot. Okay, maybe my ice was a little bit too far away. And NG too. That's interesting. Very early for both towers. Oh, we did get first blood, though. Let's go. It's just because that ice spot's not good. And also, he never upgraded it, too. Bum, 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 bum. I don't really get first blood too often with a strategy like this. It's just also, too, because everybody normally goes dart lane. Um, so, yeah. Yeah, see, look. Oh, my ice spot's not the greatest. I'm going to leak right there. Dang. <laughs> I messed up, guys. Oh, my God. L just a tad bit too far. Hopefully that won't hurt us too much. I guess I'm going to go for sub up here this time. We'll try sub up here. I'll set this to last. See, now it targets the last AI balloons, though. When did you change your username? Yo, Party Spider, thank you for the five. I recently changed it, like, probably, like, a week ago. I don't know. I just wasn't feeling the I hate late game anymore because, like, that just, like, was made due to me asking my viewers what they wanted my new name to be. So, yeah. And I was like, eh. A lot of people kept on asking me and, like, I don't know. Some people were like, who's this I hate late game guy on, like, Reddit and, t and stuff, too. So, I was like, all right, I'll just change it to Voltrix. <laughs> How long am I streaming for? Probably not too much longer. We've been streaming for, what, three and a half hours. Sheesh. That's actually a long time. But we've got, we made a lot of progress today, all right? So I am freaking very happy about that. Oh, balloon Trap. This, we haven't seen Balloon Trap too much. But we are currently seeing it. So that really sucks. Use Gwen, Gwen's ability here. Help us out a little bit. Ooh. I was about to say, once Space Whites get through, bro, because he only has ice. Maybe I should just go for close right here. Okay. Um, is that the way to go? It looks kind of worse. Let's try strong. All right, strong is the way to go. Why 
Why did I balloon boost that? I just saw yellows on the screen and it looked kind of bad. And that was far from the truth. He already got ace. That was a waste of a balloon boost. I don't know what the heck I was thinking. Update is out. No. People keep asking that. Did y'all not read the title, bro? Not nothing against you, by the way. But literally, it says in the title, "Update coming soon." <laughs> but I guess you could argue how soon is soon. So you could argue that. Alrighty. I've just been feeding his balloon trap, by the way. Just absolutely feeding it. Oh. Oh no. No shot, dude. I did so bad against that. I got up a freaking 420 ice. What? I battled. I conquered. That was so bad. I have no words for that. I don't even know what to say. That was so bad. Ooh, we got enough XP for Super Brittle, though. Ooh. Oh, we'll play another. Got to end on a new good. Got to end on a good note. Sorry. That was so bad, though. Oh, my God. Reactor is so bad. It's so bad. Yo, this is the guy. Oh, bro. What's up, Sampling? Hey. Guys, we are 74 subscribers away from hitting 294,000. If you are new, although we caught a freaking out right there, make sure to subscribe. And also drop a like. How the heck did we go down likes? We hit 1,500 likes. Oh, wait, I didn't skip this map. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm so screwed, dude. <laughs> I'm freaking starving, by the way, dude. I'm trying to eat the rest of this guac, you feel? Mmm. Yeah, it's mental weak in my blends. Yeah, I heard it's not like good right now. So I'm just not going to go for it. I'm going to go for Icicle Impel. Oh, wait. Yeah, I forgot. Shouldn't have gone. Shouldn't have went right next to it. Shoot. Yes, sir. Has Oceano been better than normal? I heard normal is better. That's what I used to use when I was in Hall of Masters. It's my favorite tower, Spike Factory. Sorry, I'm like really hungry right now. I'm really sorry. It's been hours, guys. Hours. Sub is not going to be good on this map, by the way. I might catch an all here. This is my least favorite map, too. Why did you switch to who I got first blood? Hey, it's just, oh yeah, jug on this map or spike a full, it's just not good because of the wall. Wall's getting in his way. Why did you switch from 220 to 022? Um, this ice is like actually way better, like for sure, easily. It covers more range too. I shouldn't have had it right next to the path, so I should have put it a little bit back, but 
yeah, it's way better for sure. I would start going bottom path and middle path. And then I'm, I'm, I'm using cryo canna, cannon. Um, I don't know. Ice shards hasn't really helped me out too much. Apparently cryo is pretty good. That's why like I'm pursuing, I'm locking bottom path fifth tier upgrade now for the ice. So yeah. IGN was big stuff. GGWP. Yo, Vigo, thank you for the two. Yeah, I choked that. Actually, no. I'm not even gonna choke. I'm not even gonna blame myself. I'm blaming my stupid freaking reactor. My reactor sold the freaking bread for me, bro. But GG's. Grinding for Scrammer Crucible right now. Nice, nice. How do you auto send balloons? There's hot keys. It's the middle keys. Middle row for the uh, letter keys, if that makes sense. So A through semicolon. So this is A, S, D, F, G, H. I'm holding H right now. J, K, L, semicolon. Oh, I didn't even know I was leaking. Oopsies. Sampling go one a ton of different towers over here. Look at you go, sampling. Any opinion on sniper nerf? They need to do it a little bit better. They need, need uh, to nerf it a little harder, you know? <laughs> no, I'm just showing. You think it was too harsh? I hate seeing the sniper. I think everyone's tired of seeing the sniper. It's annoying. It's stupid. It's boring. It's the same thing over and over. So, I'm glad it's getting nerfed hard. We have so much ego, by the way. What the heck? Sub is actually doing really well on this map, though, so far. So, that's good. But I'm going to make sure, like, I have enough money to go for Reactor. Because, like, I'm not trying to die like I did in the last game, bro. That was actually so dumb. Reactor is just, like, not good. When is mobile getting a buff? I know, they didn't, even, they didn't even mention anything about that, dude. Like, that actually infuriates me. No optimization for mobile users, because it's terrible for mobile. Like, that's so dumb. Get out of here. Sun's strong. I don't know how well he defends against those. Alright. Alrighty. No camera detection? Or... Okay. Oh no. No shot that fully defends. What? Wow, that's actually crazy. I'm dead. That's gonna regrow. Dang, GG's. Shoot! I didn't know that could defend that well. All right, now we're catching L's, dude. This is not good. good bro i'm sorry guys <laughs> oh 
All right, let's get it. Sun God is trash. I know, bro. Nature's revenge shall be swift and terrible. Got the W, then I Nature's got the L. I know, bro. Like, what? I didn't know that could defend. I did not know that could do that good. Yeah, someone said, man, you suck, not gonna lie. But the thing is, I'm better than you, so. That's that's the funny thing. <laughs> I'm better than you. <laughs> Alright, let's get it. Alright, we'll go for ice like right there. I'm gonna go now. All right. See MTC. And then you say cringe. Then why are you here? You're cringe for watching cringe. Cringe. Cringe kid. All right. See MTC. I still live. I know, dude. I should. I should. I should have just hopped off when I was at. <laughs> I should have just hopped off when I was at 85 or 55. I'm sorry, trophies. 100%. This is going to be my last game no matter what, guys. I'm sorry. I'm, like, getting pretty tired of playing this game. We can barely afford her. That's sick. Oh, yeah. This guy's also using meta. That's not fun. You get this map a lot? Yeah, I know, dude. Good thing is, this strategy is actually pretty good on this map, so I'm not, I'm not mad about it. Do you think they should nerf my press? Oh yeah, 100%. I'm surprised they're not. I don't know why. It is insanely OP. Two more presses can infinitely defend or stall as the OMG. Like what? That is so crazy. Why is that a thing? Everyone uses dog wire on this map. I know. Imagine using meta, bro. Imagine. God, I can't wait until it gets nerfed into the freaking ground. I'm just so tired of seeing the same towers. See, like, for example, sampling. I hate opening. Oh, what's up, sampling? Yeah, GG's, man. See, like, sampling beat me right there. Because I seriously, I don't know how or what mortar looks like that can defend against regen rainbows. I, I, I just don't know. Because I don't go against the towers because nobody freaking uses them. And I didn't play VTD6, you know? Clean up for that. Clean up, clean up, clean up, clean up, clean up, clean up, clean up. Perfect. Now I'll put this to last. I'll go for triple here. I'm gonna leak. Dang. I'd rather this I'd rather have this on last though. It's gonna be a lot better for me. It's okay. The no lives lost, it's hard with this strategy. Last game is against meta. But the the thing is. It's, it's more rewarding to take down meta. It really is. It really is. Yeah, I could have I could have probably beaten you to the camo purples. I just, like, I, I, I didn't know. I didn't know. <laughs> like, I just I just did not know. I thought you had signal flare on one of those mobs. Or, I'm sorry, not mobs. Uh, mortars. I just, I don't know these things. That's why I, I like to go against different towers. Because I learn more. You know what I mean? I learned what can and can't defend. I mean, honestly, I didn't, like, actually learn any from, anything from that game because I completely forget what the mortars look like. But, yeah. I want to see towers like that more, though. It's more interesting for me than seeing Dartling. I know what Dartling can do, and Dartling can do everything <laughs> very well. Monkey Man, thank you for the dollar donation, bro. By the way, if you guys are new to the stream, we're about to hit 294,000 subscribers, all right? I want to see how many were... Oh. Only 41 subscribers away. Please subscribe. Please. I appreciate it a lot. Thank you. Oh, no. I'm setting constant blacks. Oopsies. Good thing is, though, I don't think he's going to rush me. Can Gwendolyn attack camo, but no, no. So, but we have the um, submerged support for that to decamo balloons, so it's okay. Oh, 
Oh yeah, let's uh, put this onto first. Wow, he's been ecoing with yellows this entire freaking time. That's crazy. Let's go to the yellows now. Current meta is Ninja Dartling Sniper. Thank you for your patronage. Yeah, thank you, man, for the dono. I appreciate that. Thank you. Do you think it's unfair that mobile gets up against PC? Yes. Anyone that doesn't agree is stupid. Not actually. But, I mean, come on. Clearly, PC has an advantage. So. Not only with, like, optimization, because, like, I can just lag out a mobile user. Unless their phone's, like, god tier, you know? Most phones are gonna lag out late. <laughs> like, I can just take it late. That's so stupid. Use super instead of ninja with this strategy? Ninja ice... Yeah, that was your strategy in BTD Battles 1. So, I'm sure it's probably not bad. At least he's using Spike Factory. I'm sorry for if I said anything. <laughs> Although, still, Darling Spike Factory is good. But it's possible to beat. That's the, that's the thing. It's possible to beat. So, if he sends me a 4 to 5 mob on round 17, or I'm. Sorry, just a regular mob. I'm going to have to go for sub upgrades. Super Monkey is just too expensive. Round 18, 4 to 5 mobs, I don't know. We're just going to kind of hope and pray that he does not send either. Are they the DD? Yeah, these headphones? Yeah, I think so. Um, yep. Oh. Don't know when the update's dropping. Hopefully within the next few weeks. Can you try glue sometime? Oh yes, 100%. I actually use glue for a few games. I have all tier threes. <laughs> I was just absolutely trolling with it. Like I was just placing it down just to gain XP. The laptop, it is pretty laggy mid game. Yeah, it's unfortunate, bro. This game's just hard to, hard to run. It's like now we're kind of on the fence. Like we could go for a super monkey now. Because we have like quite a bit of money. He could send us a fortify. It's round 18. So if he does, I'm actually going to... Yeah, I'm going to go for a Super Monkey if he does. So far, though, we're good. Which is good. I'll just get that up, though. Remove this obstacle, too. Because it's going to get in the way. Oh! Well, good thing we set down the Super Monkey. Got XP for that. All right. Yeah. I'm sorry, guys, but... I'm really sorry, Monkey Man. I, I've been streaming for four hours, bro. I think it's about time to wrap up the stream. But I hope you guys did enjoy. Uh, we were literally right about to hit. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I just pulled up Twitch. Oh I was going to uh, rage someone on Twitch. <laughs> that was just the front page. It sounded so weird. Oh, Agent Sensation streaming. Let's go, baby. Let's go send over the viewers to him. All right. If you don't know Agent Sensation, he's a great guy. Really good at battles. Good vibes. So, yeah. We're going to go over to him, raid him. Yeah. If I've just been streaming for so long. 54 trophies. That's a good good place to stop, all right? But go over to Agent Sensation stream, ladies and gentlemen, all right? Go save Boltrix raid. Let him know that I sent you. And go have a good time over there, all right? He's a great guy. He deserves all the recognition. I'm just going to spam his link. All right. There we go. Go make sure to check him out. And I will see y'all in the next stream. All right. Take care, everybody. See ya.